Hello everyone, welcome in. Happy Thursday, happy time zone. I hope you're all doing well today. We have another three cozy games to check out. Uh, one of them being an update uh, for Disney Dreamlight Valley, but the other two are my first impressions uh, of two games I have never played before, so I'm really excited. Uh, I love doing these first impressions with you guys because it's like, we're discovering everything together. I just love it so much. Uh, so first of all, thank you so much to Jack, Cisco, Tansy, and Danny for modding today. I appreciate you all so much. Uh, thank you for being here and supporting the community and myself. Well, let me say hi to everyone. Let me scroll up here. Okay. Uh, Barb, hello, welcome in. And Cherry, hello. Miss Kitty and Faye, welcome in. Uh, Canis, hello. Fern, welcome in. Yeah, I know a lot of you have told me, so a lot of you have told me great things about both Wildflowers and Lakeburg Legacies, so very excited. Uh, Wyvernus, hello. Welcome in. Cece, hello. Kicknell, hello, and thank you for lurking. Uh, Ember Nova, hello. Belinda, hello. Uh, Cyberfrogs, Summy, uh, Simnis, hello, hello. Uh, Beth, welcome in. Hidden Moonstone, hello. Jaylene, welcome in. Uh, Savannah, nice to see you. Jade, hello. Terry, hello. Uh, Suga, hello, welcome in. Amy, uh, Jaylene, Shannon, welcome in. Uh, we do have three emotes for today, which of course I'm excited about as always. So we have Tara, as I believe the main character for Wildflowers. We have a stork <laughs> for Lakeburg Legacies, and we have the Moonstone, which I love that emote so much. Um, Nancy, Tolga, uh, Claudia, hello. Cherry, did I say hi to you? Cherry, hi. <laughs> hi, Cherry. Welcome in. Um, Kristen, hello. Meadow, hello. Crystal, hello. Anastasia, welcome in. Uh, Emma, hello. Welcome in. Lemon, hello, hello. Zoe, hello, hello. Welcome in. Okay, we're going to hop over to the game while I continue to say hi to you guys as you roll in. Uh, so this is what we have here. Wildflowers is up first. Uh, so if you don't know, Wildflowers has been out for a while. I think since last September. But basically you join the main character on a journey to become a witch. There's farming. There's magic. There's mysteries. Uh, zombie, thank you for the sub. Welcome in. They've also put out some updates as well since the launch. So I'm sure some of you know a lot more about this game than me. Oh yeah, and tips are okay for today, okay? Usually I have like no tips, but that's mostly for Coral Island. So tips are okay if you wanna share tips. Uh, just no like story spoilers, please and thank you. Um, I love wildflowers, I need to get back into it, says Cherry. So we're gonna start a new game. Thank you so much to Studio Dry Dock for the key. I feel like this is long over, oh my gosh. Long overdue. <laughs> the music says good morning. At least on my end it does. <laughs> Bearhaven Town. Okay, we just get right into it. We just get right into it. Ah, uh, cheese with the 10 months. Cheese, thank you so much for being a member for 10 months. We need some sunstones in the chat for cheese, please and thank you. So excited for wildflowers. Also happy for the 10 months. It doesn't feel that long. Love you all. All the love cheese. I know, right? It doesn't feel that long. Oh, I just saw rainbow flag. I just saw rainbow flag. I was not expecting us to just get right into this like beautiful little, I guess this is maybe the, the town we're going to. If I had to guess. I haven't seen anything for this game, you guys, like at all. Like at all. That's us. Look at us. Is that- that's us, right? That's Tara. And Danny with the 10 months! Danny, thank you so much! Excuse me, would you happen to know the way to Hazel Wilde's farm? Tara? Oh my goodness, it really is you, isn't it? Lena? Oh, the voice acting. I haven't seen you since I was tiny. Thank you. <laughs> it's good to see you again. I heard you were coming to stay with your grandma, Hazel. Now, do you remember the way? <laughs> uh, no. I don't remember much from that time. No problem. 
go up the stairs behind me and turn left at the top. Then just follow your nose till you get to Hazel's Follow house. your nose? You okay, I can do that. And follow the path. Got it. Left. Okay. Uh, Danny, thank you so much as well. Uh, thank you, chat, for all the sunstones too. Danny says, the time goes so fast. I know, right? Jeez, I also don't know if your alert popped up. I don't, it didn't, I didn't notice it. I'm sorry about that. I don't know if my alerts are snoozing. Uh, but all the love to Cheese and Danny. Thank you both so, so much for the support. I appreciate you so much. Um, I'm really excited to hop into this game with you guys. This game is very LGBT plus friendly. Let's go. Love to see it. Love to see it. And Miss Kitty with the Citrine membership. Thank you so much. We need some citrines in the chat for Miss Kitty, please, and thank you. Enjoy the emotes. I, I see your popsicle badge now as well. Just so you know, it melts after a month and it grows into a palm tree. If you didn't know that. Um, oh, I can click and move too. Uh, here, for some reason, popsicles grow into palm trees. <laughs> Miss Kitty, thank you so much. Enjoy the emotes. We switch them up every stream. We always have like at least one new special emote for the stream, so been doing that now for it's probably been about a month we've been doing that right you guys i feel like it's been a lot of streams with new emotes still relatively new but uh and abby with the two months oh my gosh you guys thank you so much um thank you for being a member for two months abby we need some emeralds in the chat now look we're getting almost all the colors today too we had sunstones citrines emeralds uh, super excited to catch another stream hope everyone is doing well i hope you're doing well abby thank you so so much appreciate the support thank you for being a member uh all the love miss kitty thank you so much again you guys there's a fruit fly on my screen what do i do Where, why is there a fruit fly i don't have any fruit i don't have any fruit well that's kind of a lie i have a lemon in my tea oh no i have a lemon in my tea Okay, wait, we're supposed to go, hold on. We're supposed to go left and follow my nose? Only I would be able to mess this up, right? Okay, there we go. Maybe I'm going the right way. Hey, I'm Tara. Oh, the new girl. I'm Francis. Ashante. Oh, you speak French? <laughs> well, no. Uh, <laughs> I speak Spanish, though. Bienvenidos to our little seaside pueblo. Gracias. I think I've gotten a bit turned around. Do you know the way to my grandma Hazel's house? Oh, good. House? You're nearly there. Yeah, it's you can point me in the right direction. Path, opposite the giant bell. Down the dirt path. Okay, they turned me around, literally. Down the dirt path. This one. Opposite of the giant bell. Okay, I'm going the right way. This is good. <laughs> Hazel Wild's farm. Ooh, I want a fish. I want a fish. Uh, Dangelin, hello, hello, welcome in. Oh, there's Grandma. Oh, there's the intro screen. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Blasted, rusty old crank. <laughs> I ought to blast you. <laughs> Not a bad idea, actually. <gasps> my charm will buy. Oh my goodness, right, I forgot magic. <laughs> of course. <laughs> uh Grandma? Oh, it's you. Oh, my little honeybee. <laughs> I'm not so little anymore, Grandma. No, I suppose not. I'm so glad you've come. Me too. How can I help out around here? I don't know much about farming, but maybe you can show me the ropes. Oh, I know about uh, farming. I'm good. Well, <laughs> oh, now that you mentioned I'm good. It, uh, we have lots of farming I experience. The spring crop of potatoes in yet. Let me help, Grandma. Why don't you give me those seeds and I can get them planted? That would be a good start. That sounds fun. Here's the seeds. Just Head over to one of the garden beds there and I love the and voice acting guys. Them about. That's so nice. I don't have to read it all. I mean, I like reading sometimes, but it's really nice not have to read. Uh, Nicole, hello, welcome in. A cringe emote? Yeah, probably the <laughs> the clown or I don't know. I the is that the uh-oh one? For me, that's like when I'm nervous. 
Uh, Carrie, hello, welcome in. Grandma's a fashion icon, absolutely. Yeah, I love the voice acting. It's so nice to have, especially like streaming. It's nice because you guys know sometimes my voice gets tired. Uh, from bud to spud, plant the potato seed. I can do that. Oh, we just have one. Okay. You're a natural. Oh. <laughs> now you'll need to. Work I'm a natural, yeah. To grow. <laughs> that was really complicated. You can fill it up at this old well. Okay. We'll fill it up. Excellent. My rusty watering can. Water it. Excellent, excellent. Potato! We there would get now, to start off with potatoes. <laughs> It'll take a few days to grow, but My it's favorite. A oh, and I was thinking about cooking up some mushrooms oh my How gosh would you like mushrooms potatoes and dinner? mushrooms is it the same one you used to make when i was little because if it is yes please <laughs> lovely you'll find plenty of mushrooms good for eating if you head up that mountain path a little wait we have to pick the mushrooms ourselves <laughs> <laughs> no this isn't the city honeybee besides freshly picked mushrooms taste better yeah if they're not the kind that poison you yeah exactly that's what i'm thinking just fine. <laughs> i want to find I'll the right ones best. is there anything else i can do for you well if you wanted to get some new seeds in town it might be a good time to stop by and see the mayor introduce yourself he's at town hall a big building in the center of town with a flag above the door you can't miss it I'll take good care of you and this farm, Grandma. I'm just so glad you're here, my sweet little honeybee. All right, here I am, farming. <laughs> this place has changed so much. It'll take a lot of work to get back to how I remember. I don't know if city life has prepared me for this, but I'm. Oh, ready to we'll give it my be best. fine. We'll be fine, Tara. Don't worry. Um, okay, the only hard thing about voice acting is I feel like I, I don't want to talk over the voice acting. Um, okay, we need... Are you... Okay, so what I was thinking is, like, they literally started me off with potatoes and mushrooms. It's like they know me. All these quests. Okay, so we need more seeds. We need to get... I think I saw somewhere that I can change the day speed. I'm gonna put it to relaxed for my first day. Um, just to... Make sure I, I get, a, get a hang of things. Um, if you guys didn't know, mushrooms and potatoes are like my favorite. And I'm always like, I couldn't pick between the two. So we get both in this game too, which is great. Heather says, love my popsicle grown palm tree. I see it, I see it. Uh, Lizzie, hello. Nuku, hello, welcome in. Melek, hello, welcome in. Uh, Samantha says to pick weeds every day. That's a great tip, thank you. Uh, Brian, hello, welcome in. Uh, Heather, thank you for lurking. Cheese, sorry to hear you have a meeting. I hope it's awesome, though. I hope it's awesome. Maybe you can make it back. Um, okay, so we're gonna go get mushies. Is that what we're doing? Ariel, hello, hello. Uh, yeah, we're farming in healed boots today. <laughs> we sure are. We sure are. I hope I'm going the right way. Hey, oh, cutscene's a good sign. Oh, is there mining in this? Seven. But so did everything around here. I didn't even think about mining. Uh, Simon, hello, and Danny with the six months. Let's go. Let's go. And also, Danny, you completed the the color collection today. So now we've had all the crystals. Uh, we need some amethyst in the chat for Danny. Six months. Uh, OMG, finally at six months. It's gone so fast. I'm so happy and honored to be a part of an amazing community and to watch your content, Sarah. You're amazing. Don't ever stop what you're doing. Danny, you're amazing. Thank you so, so much. Um, cheers to six months. I'm so happy you got your little drink badge. It's so cute. Danny, I appreciate all the support. I appreciate your kind words. That is so sweet. That is so sweet. Thank you so, so much. We've been counting down the days for that one. Look, I got the mushrooms. I didn't even... Didn't even struggle. Oh, look at this bridge. Question? Danger. <gasps> danger. Okay. <laughs> we won't go towards danger. Well, I, even though I want to. Um, Danny, thank you again so, so much. 
leave a few leave a few weeds, but pick every day. Uh, Stephanie, hello, welcome in. Beth, did I say hi to you? Beth, hello. Gloria, hello, welcome in. Setting up a restart for the new Coral Island update. Nice. Uh, and Nemore, hello, welcome in. Okay, where am I going? Is there a map? There's a map. Okay, so we need to go here, I'm guessing, to get seeds. More potato seeds. I think that's what it said. Well, it said to meet the mayor. The fungus among us. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's try going into town. Uh, and I totally know where I'm going. Okay, we're gonna go. Just go straight. Just go straight. I think. Uh, hi to Amy as well. I like the terror emote, it's cute. Um, oh. <laughs> am I go I'm not going the right way, am I? I'm not supposed to go down these stairs. They just look so tempting, I wanna go back to the ocean. Okay, this way. I got it, I got it. Ooh, jewelry? A bakery? That looks so cute. Oh yes, here's the flag. There's a little town board. <gasps> Bulletins. Oh, I like these mushies. Shells. Little quests. Oh my gosh, what is... What are you doing? Did you see that? He like threw something in the air. <laughs> oh, hello. Welcome, <laughs> welcome, welcome. I uh, just got hello, welcome Soft, in. And you must be the new voter. I mean, neighbor. Oh. Uh, hi. Uh, <laughs> yes, that's that's me. If there is anything you uh, need, I'm the one to speak to. I don't know if I like auto. We're a friendly town here at Fairhaven. We want to make sure you're settled in well. To that end, we want you to meet everyone. So we've made it a little game. <laughs> the fine Fairhaven folk will let me know. After oh, great. They that way. I can give yeah, you a me. Prize after you've met everyone. A prize? It's really quite Tears clever. me, that, that expression. <laughs> Plus a little bit creepy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're funny. Anyway, come and okay, see me. Okay, I don't like Otto. You've met everyone. That's kind that is kind of creepy. He's like, "Oh, everyone will report back to me once you've introduced yourself to them." Like, "Hey, what if I don't want to though?" The mayor wants you to meet everyone in town. Apparently, it's a game and I get a prize. Okay. Oh, this flower shop is cute. Wait, where do I get the seeds? From... She said something about getting more seeds. Uh, Amy, thank you for lurking. I wish time in the game was controlled by a slider. At least, at least there is some control, right? At least we have that option. But yeah, I could see that. Nobody that plays Wildflowers likes auto. I can see why. Show hint. Uh, Danny, take care. Thanks for hanging out. Yeah, we're we're off to a great start. Okay, it doesn't tell me where to get them. Oh, look, the residents. Crafting? Oh, crafting. A candle maker? Wait, what? Paper press? <gasps> I can make candles? Okay, spoilers. That is so cool though. General store is south of the town hall. Oh, look at these cute little market stalls too. Oh, here. Here. There you are. Oh, and Tara too. Wonderful. Tara, this is my husband, Parker. Hi there. Hey, Parker. Tara, I can't wait to buy your fresh crops. And if you need seeds, I can sell you whatever's in season. Oh, Parker, we need to talk <laughs> She just about says the nothing. They were giggling over breakfast, so I searched Finn's backpack and found a whoopee cushion in there. Again. <laughs> I, I mean, that's that's terrible. Uh, 
See? That's the problem Wait, what? Right there. You think it's funny, and I have to be mommy cop. No, it's I'm just a whoopee cushion. Really. Okay, whatever. You can be the one to go to the next parent teacher conference. Oh, I see. Bringing a it to school. Getting stared down by Vanessa. Okay. Yeah, that's so cool. You can make candles. That's really unique. Okay, I just need some. I want some candy actually, but I just want potato seeds. Ooh, out of season. Sell more to unlock. Interesting. Okay, let's just get potatoes, which are here. Wait, do I have money? Oh, I do. Okay. <laughs> I just realized I might not have money. And I need three. I think, because we have one. Thank you, Lena. Yeah, four. Okay. Parker's your favorite? Uh, Vovi, hello, hello. Am I supposed to talk to you? Hey, how's it going? Damon? I'm Damon. You're Hazel's granddaughter, yeah? How did you guess? You got the same Gotta eyes. introduce they myself. Say, I'm beautiful. To everyone. I don't suffer fools. I'll take that as a call. What does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> I run the bar. What does that Stop mean? For good vibes and a sympathetic ear any old time. Yeah, thanks. Awesome. Oh, hey, Bruno. Damon. I want to settle up for last night. Sorry I didn't have it on me at the time. <laughs> That's all right. I knew you were good for it, but, uh, <laughs> thanks. Fish just haven't been biting lately, but I got Otto to float me for a week. I wish you hadn't told me that. Your son already has it out for me, Bruno. That's not so. Oh my He's gosh, there's drama. All. And who's your new friend here? Uh, Amy, talk. thank you so much for the six months. Aren't you? Yes. Are you German? And also psychic? <laughs> I'm Bruno. Don't actually speak much of my native tongue, but I try to keep up some traditions. And you're just the picture of your grandma when she was a girl. I am? Yeah! She was a real sweet. I don't know how I feel about all this. It's a tension. Much. I see you met Damon. Tara, watch out for this boy. He's trouble. <laughs> hey, I'm trying to make a good first impression here. Do you mind? Oh my goodness. Amy, thank you so much for being a member for six months. We need some emeralds in the chat for Amy. Cheers to that. You have your drink badge too. Let's go. A member for six months. Let's go. Thank you so, so much, Amy. I appreciate all the support so, so much. All the love, all the love. I don't know what I'm doing. I do love the voice acting, but it's like, I can't. Let's just, let's just go plant my potatoes. I can't talk to you guys when when they're talking. It's like I'm competing. I'm competing for mic time. I'm gonna go plant the potatoes. Bruno is Otto's dad. We love Bruno. Bruno seems nice. Suffer fools is an old saying that means you don't tolerate BS from people. Okay. I did not know that. Oh, I got, f wait. I need more garden beds. I just realized grandma only has two. I'll need to make some more. Uh, Amy says, sorry, I've not been on for a while. I've had a lot going on, but she'll be back on fully soon. Amy, no need to apologize. You guys, you know, whenever it fits for you guys, I'll be here. No need to apologize. Um, let's see, can I make more of these? Okay, we need wood and soil. And I would find those materials. There's wood here. Can I just take this stuff? <laughs> Not allowed? Okay. Oh my gosh. Uh, let's go back to the, go back through town to the forest. Oh, can I just cut? I guess I don't even have an axe, actually. Should I give grandma my the mushrooms for soup? I'll automatically jump over fences. <gasps> wow, she can really jump. She can really jump. Jeez, thank you so much for lurking. Guys, I have no idea what I'm doing. I love the jumping. Who says you can't do parkour in a dress? 
Uh, Daniela, hello. Pumpkin, hello. Welcome in. Ooh, this looks interesting. <gasps> Look at the little mice. Look at them. They're so cute. Ah, I see you found the barn. This is it? I went looking for it, but I, I wasn't sure. <laughs> Remember the time I milked Bessie and she kicked over the milk bucket? I hid in the barn because I thought you would be mad. <laughs> no use crying over spilled milk. Or a barn that got blown down in a storm, I suppose. I had to give up keeping cattle. I want so the mice. This is... yeah, I want them as pets. Coop. Look at them. Uh, after Merlin passed, I didn't have a dog Merlin? to guard the chickens. And they kept getting picked off. I chopped up the coop for firewood. Oh, that's a shame. Do you think we could restore them? Well, I'm oh, sure we can have we farm could. animals. But after that old ranch closed up, the nearest place to get more animals is miles away. Uh, if Mayor Otto would bestir <laughs> himself to do something about that. Oh, uh, not Mayor Otto. Up these buildings I already like definitely don't like Mayor her. Otto. Okay. Can I keep these mice? No. Uh, pick up the rocks for stone and branches for- Oh, I can just pick this up? I guess that- Sarah, that's not a branch. <laughs> I don't think that's considered a branch. I can pick that up though. Oh, this is a branch over here. I see. Branch. That's wood. Okay, so I needed wood and... Was it clay or soil or something? Uh, Hassan, hello. Uh, Kendra, hello. Welcome in. And Jack with the gifted membership! Jack, thank you so much! It went to Simness. Uh, Simness, you, you now have emotes, courtesy of Jack, that you can use. Jack, thank you so, so much. All the hearts and hype. Uh, some citrines as well for Simness. Welcome in. Enjoy, enjoy. Thank you so, so much. You can also use the emotes in comments. I like to remind you guys that too. If you don't chat a lot, you can also use them in like video comments, which is fun. Is this a weed? Like this? Oh, yeah. I see, I see. It's a collapsed mine shaft. <laughs> Looks like I can't get into it until it's fixed. I want to go mining. Uh, Jack, thank you again so, so much. I need weeds to make soil. You'll need to make a compost bed. Oh, okay. So I should be making that first. I probably don't necessarily need like four garden beds. I just thought I did for the potatoes. I guess I could work towards that over time. Um, let's pick up some stuff. Like you can never have too much stuff until you fill up your, your bag and then you run out of space and then... Yeah, you guys know the routine. The weeds are hard to come by. These ones, right? Oh, that was thistle. Is that considered a weed? Where's my pocket? Oh, here we go. Oh, okay. Wait, do I have like a limit on this in my bag? Uh, Rachel, hello, welcome in. Playing Coral Island and watching this stream is making for a pleasant evening. I love that. I love that. Yeah, I wonder if we'll get the beta next week now. I don't know. I'm just, me just, sorry, sorry I'm just running around <laughs> aimlessly. <laughs> That's uh, one of my strengths, is exploring. Oh, each plot makes four of what I planted. Oh, so I don't even need the four plots. I see. But maybe in the future they'll come in handy to have extras. I do have to keep introducing myself to people. Ah, hello there. Nice to see a new face around here. Hi, I'm Hazel Wild's granddaughter, Tara. Oh, 
Hazel was so kind to me when I first moved here. Used to let no me inventory to limit. To get to the old mine. Oh, I love I that. Before the supports in the entrance gave out. There's still good ore down there, I suspect. Or oh, sorry, I didn't introduce myself. I'm Natalia, and I own the blacksmith. I can melt down ore into ingots and upgrade any of your farm tools for you. Okay, that's cool. I wanna, yeah, I really wanna go mining. Uh, Miu, hello, hello. That is Tara. This is Tara, the main character of this game. Sonia, hello, welcome in. Should we just go introduce ourselves to everyone? Can I go in houses? No, Sarah, why would you be able to do that? This isn't Coral Island. <laughs> this isn't Coral Island. You can't just walk into people's houses. The jewelry box? Okay. We take and bake the cake. Oh, this looks cute. Violet's Violet's? That's such a cute name. Is this the school? Children? Oh, that's cute. They're actually playing. Oh, here's another person. Oh, I met you already, right? That counted? I think that counted. Uh, Takumi, hello, hello, welcome in. I could talk to the kids, but I'd prefer to talk to other characters first. <gasps> Look at the cat! Oh, what a good purr. You can pet the cat! Oh, the houses are completely inaccessible. Okay. I thought it was just like, you know, what you'd expect to like not be able to just invade a house. Like Coral Island, you can just go in whenever Welcome you want. Welcome to the island. I am Messenger Cameron Connor. Messenger. Hey. As one newcomer to another, please let me know if there's okay. anything I could do to help. Okay, okay, gotcha. That was a quick introduction. Oh, hello. And who is this beautiful creature I see? I, uh... uh what? Why, uh, why is everyone so... I'm Tara, Hazel's granddaughter. <laughs> Hazel told me her granddaughter was coming to town, but didn't mention that she was so lovely. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I'm Amira, the doctor here in Fairhaven. Oh, I've doctor, no. Care of your grandmother. Oh, wow, <laughs> thank you. I came as soon as I heard she was They're sick. so, like, forward. She's lucky to have such a caring family. Well, I mean... We have a mixture honest, on Cameron. Ew, Cameron, and Cameron's cute. Touch for <laughs> a while. I'm trying to make up for lost time. We can't regain lost time. But you're here for her now. That is enough. The kids do... Oh, the kids do count as people? Oh, okay. For the quest, I mean. Okay. We'll... we'll We'll circle back. Oh, wow. Look at this place. What is this? Whoa, the gates? Uh, Tansy with the gifted membership. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. It went to Shay. Shay, you now have emotes courtesy of Tansy. We need some hearts and hype in the chat for Tansy. Some citrines to welcome in Shay. Enjoy the emotes. Oh, the mailboxes tell me who lives where. Who lives here? Wait, let me guess. The mayor. <laughs> yeah, it looks about right. Uh, Tansy, thank you again so much. I appreciate that. I appreciate that so much. Just your friendly local doctor <laughs> hitting on potential future patients in a graveyard. When you put it that way, it sounds so... That doesn't sound... It sounds like... Okay, it sounds like Charles. Isn't that giving Charles or just me? I feel like that's giving Charles. Hi, I'm Kim. Hey, Kim. I'm Tara. I just moved here from the city. <laughs> uh, Fern, you like the doctor? So what sent you screaming from the city? Dead end job? Sociopaths on dating apps? Uh, the job. I got let go from my job in the city, so I came here for a That's cool, there's dialogue I choices. I came here to try something new, too. They're on the butcher. We only sell humanely treated animal products. Right now, I have okay. to source the meat from off-island. 
but we'll hopefully get a new rancher to move here soon. Cool. Nice to meet you. A rancher, you say? I happen to know someone. I happen to know someone. Although, I don't think Kenny would sell any of his animals. <laughs> so. Oh, look, this is... <gasps> Can we go to the beach? I like the beach. Ocean view countryside. I like this. Or Jack. I don't think either of them would sell their, their animals, though. Ooh, is that gonna be a lighthouse? It looks like there's a lot of stuff to like fix up in this game. Oh, that looks nice too. A little orchard. Uh, Jendon, hello, hello, welcome in. Uh, I met you. Wait, look at these beach houses. <gasps> little, cr hi. I want to pet these things. <gasps> Don't step on it. <gasps> Don't step on it. <laughs> you can move the character by clicking. As well as like the keyboard, which is interesting. I want one of these beach houses like IRL. Aren't they so cute? Do people live here? Damon and Kai. I already don't remember half the character names. Cameron lives here. Amira lives here. Okay, interesting. They're so cute. Yeah, I want to live in them too, Shannon. Uh, ducks aren't real. Hello, hello. Yeah, I know. I can't believe it's taken me so long to try this game out. <gasps> Bananas? What is this? Can I pick it up? Seaweed. Conch shell. I love shells. This is cute. Banana hype. I did have a banana before stream. But that won't stop me from having one on my break. <laughs> oh, this is cute. Witchweed. That's cute. Look at this place. I want to live here. Thomas? Who's Thomas? Oh, is this Thomas? Look at this! There's fruit trees. All these garden beds. Look at this. Carrots, potatoes, wheat. This is so nice. Hello? Are you Thomas? Oh, I just Hi. sit down? I'm really? Kira. Hazel Wild wow. Nice to meet you. No, I remember you. <laughs> You used to run past my farm on the way to the beach when this you This is were too living. close. Yes! And Grandma always told me to mind that I didn't trample your crops. You're Thomas, right? Yep. Gosh, your farm has the most stunning view on the whole Thomas has the best, the best property. I, I didn't mean... Your grandma needs help on her farm. But it's not as easy as just moving here and picking up a pitchfork. I know. I'm here to learn. For Hazel's sake, I hope you learn quick. Okay. I mean, that's what I get for just, like, taking a seat without being invited. Can I jump this fence, too? Oh, that's a- there's a gate. I love this. Oh, look, an abandoned house. Maybe this will be a ranch? In the future, this looks like where the rancher will move to. Yeah, nice open spaces. Cheese, your meeting's done already? Let's go. Welcome back. Welcome back. Oh yeah, this'll be the ranch for sure. That's nice. I'm just exploring, by the way. Uh, I've met you. Can I see people on the map? No oh look, this opened up. Oh, I didn't go across that bridge. I'll go check that out. Watching Sarah while grinding for a red barrel feels like it might give me some luck in finally getting one. I hope it does. I hope it does. You can do it. I believe in you. I believe in you. You got this. We love Thomas. Just a little grumpy at first. I could see that. Anything I can pick up? No. 
Hopefully we can fix that up. That'd be cool. And there is romance in this game, I'm pretty sure. I don't know who the romanceable candidates are. Look at this little crab. I want to pet. <gasps> Look at the view. That's so nice. Fern, you have a crush on, on Thomas? <laughs> there's always, you know, there's always, I love it. Everyone, there's always someone in chat who has a crush on like everyone. Like every different character has someone who's interested in them. Which really goes to show these games do such a good job at like, creating like a diverse cast with interesting characters that appeal to like so many people in different ways oh this connects back i see i see so we did like a loop so this was the farm the abandoned ranch the beach houses the lighthouse this is our area okay i need to go like over this way i feel like do i pass out <laughs> There's six characters you can romance? Oh, nice. I'm mostly interested right now in making candles. <laughs> I love my unlimited inventory space. This is like the best. Uh, Iris, thank you so much for the sub. Welcome in. Who lives here? Okay, this doesn't help me because I don't even remember the characters' names. And I haven't met all of them yet. Let's go this way. I wonder when my day ends. Two? Oh, that's good. Yeah, unlimited inventory. Isn't that awesome? Uh, Johnny, hello. AJ, hello. Welcome in. Oh, look. The kids are gone. What a shame. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I love kids. Sometimes, just in games, it depends how they're written, you know? It depends how they're written. I like these little footprints that show you can go down different paths. Fairhaven Woods. Oh, this looks cool. <gasps> Look at the tree. Is that like a willow tree? This is pretty. AJ, you love this game? You like the way the kids are written in this game, Lizzie? That's good to know. That is great to know. Oh, look at all these mushies. I will take them all. <gasps> the cat's here too? The kids are great in this game. Oh, that's such a relief. Uh, not Sarah convincing me to add another cozy game to my Steam wish list. Oh. I don't know if I should say sorry or or what. I just like doing these types of streams with you guys so then you know, I can present them to you and then you guys can decide if it's something you're interested in or not. I hope they're helpful. I hope they've been helpful for you guys to figure out which games you'd like to play, which ones you're maybe going to pass on. You know, because it's such a... a personal decision. See, look at this tree. This is so beautiful. Hmm. There's a plaque that reads, This beloved tree be old as the town itself. It's so pretty. I love this type of tree. I love that you can pet the cat. Are there any dogs? I want a dog. Who lives here? Shelby. I don't know who Shelby is. This is a this is a great place to live. This is where I want to live. I said that about 
I said that about the other property too. Oh, what's this? A peanut? Speaking of peanuts, we need some peanuts in the chat. I just found a peanut on the ground. Okay. I'll be staying in this town for sure. For sure, for sure. Uh, Abby says they definitely helped me. Looking forward to Lakeburg Legacies on the fence with that one. I have no idea what to expect from it either. So that'll be interesting. It's a little bit of a different game than what I would typically, uh, you know, gravitate towards. Different like style of game. So I'm interested to uh, check that out with you guys for sure. Shelby's place is the best. It's so cute. Like I want to play, um, I do want to play Fay Farm. Yeah. I do want to play Fay Farm. I definitely would like to. Okay, I think I discovered everything over here for now. Oh, that's this area. Wait, wait, wait. There's an area up here? How do I get there? Um. A pin. Hello, hello. Peanut on the ground and a cat. Yeah, it's like a two for one. <laughs> Can I go around here? No. I don't know how to get up there. Maybe a different entrance? Or over here? Was there a place over- Oh, this! It's blocked off, maybe? I mean, it looks like it is, but- There's... Whispering? <gasps> there's a cauldron! What is that? Look, there's a cauldron over here. Weird is going on here. There's a cauldron back there. There is something going on. Interesting. Ah, uh, Sierra! Hello, hello! Welcome in! Glad you could catch a stream. Yeah, I like that there's areas you can't access immediately. I love that in games. And you like unlock new areas. So yeah, I think we've now been basically everywhere. Oh, I'm supposed to deliver. Oh my gosh, is grandma even gonna be awake? I'm supposed to deliver the mushrooms. <laughs> I was supposed to deliver the mushrooms to grandma. It's 9 p.m. I feel like that's past grandma's bedtime. Uh, Danny, welcome back. I, I might have messed up. We're supposed to have soup. <laughs> We're supposed to have soup. The stores are super cute. Oh, grandma's still up. Okay, surprisingly. I have the mushrooms. Um, mushrooms. Ah, spring is the time when the earth reawakens. You can forage for the gifts the land offers up if you know where to look. Have you found any mushrooms? Uh, Princess Luna, thank you so much for the sub. I love the foraging. I love just picking stuff up. And thank you guys so much for liking the stream. I appreciate it so much. Thank you, thank you. Uh, grandma doesn't sleep. That's good to know. Well, I feel like grandma should work? sleep. Those are nice plump ones. You're a natural forager. When I was out searching, I came across that old mine. You used to tell me that there were goblins inside. Remember? <laughs> I told you that, did I? <laughs> it was a, a smart way of keeping a curious little girl out of danger. The wood in the support rotted clean through. Shame. I'm sure there's still perfectly good iron and copper down there. Come back tomorrow and I'll have the mushroom stew prepared. I'm a bit tired just now. Oh, well, I, why don't I make it? Why don't I make the mushroom stew? Um, I don't have the potatoes yet. I do not have the potatoes yet. Okay. Wait, can I go in this little shed? Yes, I can. You know, I don't think I've been in here since your grandpa died. Oh, sorry. I was just looking around like you said. I didn't mean to pry. No, 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 it's fine. I just wasn't as good with my hands as he was. He gave most of his tools to Thomas, since I knew he'd put them to good use. You know, if we want to get this place up and running, though, we'll need to put in the work here, too. We always made a whole lot more money from his crafts than just the farm produce alone. 
If you ever want to try your hand at it, I kept the blueprints to all of his tools right here. Thanks, Grandma. Not sure if I'm a handy Tara, but I'll try for us. This is how I make candles. <laughs> Thanks, Grandma. Grandma, you should go to sleep. Go get some rest. Oh, yeah, paper press, candle maker. So we're definitely gonna need to get that mine open. Oh, I can make the paper press. Otherwise we need like, ore to make bars. See if we can get some more uh, wood. What do I think of the game so far? I enjoy playing this on my phone. All right, this is this is a mobile game too, right? Uh, so far I enjoy it. I'm mostly just wandering around aimlessly though <laughs> and picking things up and exploring. Uh, but so far so good for me. I do really love the voice acting. Um, honestly, I might go to bed because I don't know. I feel like I've picked everything up that I can. And plant the seeds. Yeah, I think I'm going to go to bed. There, good. Grandma's going to bed. Okay. Am I ready for bed? Yes. <sighs> Voice acting is great. Yes, I agree, you guys. A candle emote. <laughs> Wait, what's happening? Oh, this is that entrance. The thorn stuff. Oh, that's a cool mask. Can I have one of those? Oh. Oh. It sounds kind of spooky. I don't know why that sounded kind of spooky to me. Good morning, Tara. Another day. Uh, Arnica with the 999. Arnica, thank you so, so much. Can we please get some hearts and hype in the chat for Arnica? Uh, hi, just popping in to say thanks for the great content. Hope everyone is having a nice day. I hope you're having a nice day too. Thank you so much for the support. I appreciate that so much, Arnica. Thank you so much. All the love, all the love. Very sweet of you. Okay, Grandma, I'm up. Lena brought us some extra milk while you were out, so I made us I love a mushroom delicious soup. mushroom soup sure to warm I love it. our bellies. And your, your shirt had the right number of uh, gills or whatever. We're not going to start seeing things or frothing at the mouth. Wait, what? Oh no, if I gave you something that made you see things, it'd be on purpose. Uh, Grandma! <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I'm just kidding, honey. Wait, what? Now, I have another chore for you that... Yeah, give me the chores. I can do chores. Mind. Of course, Grandma. What is it? Some wood for the fire would be nice. Oh, good. Not I think I already have some wood. In the spring around How here. much do you need? Could you go and find a couple of the big old logs lying around the farm? Oh, I can chop, chop them? them? up for me and bring me the wood? Sure thing, Grandma. Uh, you'll need this I need an axe. to get started. The fungus among us. Yay. Cream of mushroom soup. A great way to top up your energy. Cool. Uh, we need to get wood. Chop two logs. Got it. If what is this? Oh no, I know how to do that. Thank you. Uh, okay. Okay, let me see what I missed out on here. Don't forget to water those potatoes. Every oh day. my gosh, right. I'm actually so glad she reminded me. <laughs> I do wish we could sometimes I wish we could create our own character too in this game, but I know they're like telling a story of a certain character. Um, but I do really like character customization in games, so I agree with that. That would be nice. We'll water these right away so I don't forget. Yeah, let's put some let's put some Terras in the chat to start off our next day of grand adventures and foraging. See if we can chop these logs now, which will help with collecting wood. Maybe we can even make the paper press or whatever it's called. 
Oh, and I have stamina. Okay, good to know. Excellent. Chop another one. Excellent. I think it's cool that Tara and Grandma have the same eyes. They really do, hey? It's really nice. It's really sweet. It's a nice little detail. Um, okay, what do we have in total? Do I have enough for the paper press and for Grandma? Because I'd like to do both. And Jack with the gifted membership! Jack, thank you so much. You know what we need, chat. We need some hearts. We need some hype. We need some citrines. The membership went to Lou. Lou, you have emotes now, courtesy of Jack. You can use them. You can put terrors in the chat now. You can put terrors in the chat. Along with everyone else. Jack, thank you so, so much. I appreciate that. Look at all the beautiful emotes. Ugh. We just create art every day. As a community, don't we? With the emotes. <laughs> I love it. Oh, that wood looks nice and dry and ready to burn. Great. Thank you for doing that for me. It was no trouble. Phew. It was hard work, though. Oh, look at you. You're plum tuckered out. I am plum tuckered well, out. <laughs> young girls in the city these days, anyway. If you work too hard and don't keep an eye on your Why energy, am I plum tuckered out after chopping two out. logs? But there's an easy solution. Good old fashioned country cooking. Here's another serving of the soup I made earlier. Oh, wow. It'll Extra soup. Right up. Wouldn't you know it? Don't wear yourself out. Eat something from your bag to get some energy back. I still have energy. I'm not that worn out, Grandma. Do I use stamina jumping? No. Tiana, hello, hello. You love this game? So glad to hear. I know a lot of you guys have been recommending me this game, like, for a long time. So, it seemed, like, perfect when Studio Dry Dock reached out with the key, which I appreciate. So I know you guys love this game, a lot of you. I think it, it came out in September last year, right? I saw they recently came out with like a fabulous farming update, which looked really cool. Because we love farming here. Uh, Soybean, thank you for the sub. Welcome in. Oh yeah, we gotta go talk to people. That's what we have to do. They don't show- I keep checking. I'm too used to checking on the map for people. They're not there. They're not on the map. We have to do it the old-fashioned way. Actually, finding people. Um, so if I've met someone, I can still go Hola. talk to them again, I guess? Hey, and they have new dialogue? Well I'm, you so far? I'm still figuring everything out. Well, let me know if anyone ever repairs the entrance to the mine by oh, the farm. Oh, I would I love to know shop, but it's if someone could do that. It's a making jewelry without actual jewels, you know? Crafting beautiful pieces is one thing. But sourcing the stones is tough. I'll let you know. Francis. Oh, person, you're new. <laughs> the walk. Hey, bro. Hey, hey bro. But, uh, I I'm not a bro. My name's Kai. I run a kiosk near town square. It's like uh, a pop-up shop. What do you sell? Did she say, I'm oh, not a bro? Dude, you have to see it to believe it. <laughs> Look at the crab. I sell the most killer <laughs> stuff I find off island. Come by and check it out. But like I say, if you fall in love with something, better get it. The merchandise is just whatever feels right in the moment. Uh -huh. You know? What? Okay. What? These people are very interesting. Very interesting with their little lines. Oh, there's the cat. I want to go pet the cat again. I know you guys, 16.5k subs. Thank you all so much for the support. Thank you so much. I can't believe it. That's crazy. It's crazy. 
We're making our way towards 17,000. That is not, I mean, when you say it like that. Thousand, that's a lot of thousands. He's like, Ben. Gems, I need gems. I need to find the gems. I also want all of these critters as pets. I guess my, I probably have the best chance of running into people in the town. I just really like the beach and I wanted to pet the cat because I like the cat. Let's go into town. We'll run into people there for sure. Francis is one of your favorite characters, AJ. The little pose, the little arm behind the head pose <laughs> was something for sure. Thank you guys so much. Y'all are so sweet. Kicknell says I might have to get ready for my next Sarah Milestone project sometime soon. I am so excited for that. Whenever it is. I'm excited to see that. I'm trying to get a... Like a shelf. Wait, I haven't been here. Have I been here? Oh yeah, this is where I... Never mind. This is where I started. But I just didn't even notice this cute bar. This is really cute. Um, I'm trying to get like a shelf installed in my recording area to put up like some of the stuff you guys have sent me. Your beautiful creations. Um, but I didn't want to do it myself because I didn't want to accidentally like, I don't know. Put a hole in the wrong spot in the wall. I don't know. <laughs> oh, this is the shop. This is Total Ben Vibes. Connected Discord to YouTube. Let's go. Yes, you guys, make sure if you're on the Discord, you have your accounts connected. Because then you get your gemstone rolled there. And there's like specific channels as well for different tiers. I want to go back on the boat. Can I go back on the boat? Can I go island hopping? Ooh, prepaid tickets to milk water. Oh, and there's another boat here. I bet that's the fisher's boat. Maybe. bar opens at night i want to go to the bar who's this hello oh this is so cute it's like a diner welcome to cafe moretti that's what cute you today oh i'm new here i just came by to say hello it does smell great in here though wait you're hazel's granddaughter <laughs> Welcome. Uh, I hope you come back soon. Moving always works up an appetite. Oh, where are my manners? I'm Sophia. Hey, Sophia. I'm Tara. It's nice to meet you. I love the diner. Sophia Moretti. Wait, that's the last name that... I was half paying attention. I was reading chat. <laughs> my Discord is chill. Oh, Miss Kitty says, for anyone who's not on Sarah's Discord, I highly recommend it. Everyone is super nice and helpful. It's a wonderful community. You guys, I love you all so much. Like, seriously, I just, every day, I just wake up and I pinch myself because I'm like, do we really? Okay, sorry, I'm not, stop. I'm, I'm still, Charles, <laughs> I know Charles isn't in this game, but I can't help but, yeah, I just, you guys, if you know, you know. I'm going to avoid, I'm going to meet new characters first. I'm gonna try and meet more new characters. Uh, yeah, I'm very grateful for you guys. It's like such an incredible community we've created. And I love that we've kept the awesome vibes even with the growth on the channel. That's like super impressive to me. And I'm very, very Hello. grateful for Are it for sure. Are you my mom's new friend? Depends. Who's your mom? This is oh. what, <laughs> okay. Then yes, nice to meet you. I'm Tara. Nice to meet you too. I'm Finn. I feel weird that I just like walked into their classroom and I'm like talking to everyone in the middle of their lesson. Oh, hey, you're new here. I'm Sebastian. Who are you? I'm Sebastian. Tara. I just moved here to help out my grandma Hazel. Do you know her? Oh, yeah. Hazel's cool. Like, for a grown up. Uh, I'll see you around. <laughs> okay. Hello. You're a stranger. Yes, I I just moved here. I'm Tara. What's your name? Emmy. Why am I interrupting their lesson? Well, now we're not strangers. I know that's anymore, what I'm saying. For the quest. 
Oh, look at her hair. That's cute. An effort to make you feel welcome in town or whatever. So, um, Juliet. Hi, I guess <laughs> I'm Juliet. Hey, Juliet. It's nice to meet you. Okay. Bye. That's my favorite kid. Hi. Sorry to interrupt your welcome. lesson. I am Vanessa, Vanessa Soft, First Lady of Fairhaven. Pleasure oh. to meet you. How is your grandmother doing? Vanessa she's, Soft. Well, to be honest, she's not doing too well. That's why I'm here. It's wonderful that you came to help her out. Do let me know if there is any way I can help. <laughs> the teacher should be very upset with me. What a fit. What a fit. Okay, so there we go. We met a bunch of people. Oh, I want to meet this person. Look at the purple hair. Hi. Oh my gosh, you gotta be Tara! Violet. Hazel's been hyping you up for weeks now. Well, now I'm embarrassed. Don't be. It's sweet. <laughs> I wish I had a grandma here to talk about how great I am. Anyway, I'm Violet. Pleased to meet you, Violet. You we guys are get so too funny. Many new faces around here in Fairhaven, so let me know if you ever want to hang out. It's so interesting. My favorite and least favorite thing about this game is the voice acting because and only because I'm streaming. I feel like I don't get to chat with you guys as much, but I love it because I get to save my voice a bit and it's really well done. I like this character. I like her hair a lot. And this shop is so cute. Violet has violet hair. It's such a cute shop. Is Violet... Is Violet dateable? Do we know? Do you ask every new resident to play Have I met everyone yet? Meet everyone Mayor? There? Oh, yes! After all, that idea won me third place in the Icebreaker Innovation category at the annual mayoral convention. Congratulations? Oh, hush. It's hardly worth mentioning. She's not? She's not? Okay, maybe that's my least favorite part of the game. <laughs> yes, I am that Angus. Angus. Excuse me? Oh, I could tell you were wondering if you recognized me. <laughs> I, I was, because I thought you looked kind of like Charles. An episode of Baking Battles. <laughs> Always nice to meet a fan. Oh. oh. Yes, I thought that was you. What with this being a, a bakery and all. <laughs> yeah, I guess it's obvious. My little claim to fame. Okay. Oh, I only need to meet one more person. Charles? Baking battles? Fern says, Charles, is that you, my love? I'm Fern, I'm so glad Charles has you. <laughs> okay, I need to find... The cat is my favorite character. Juliet is my favorite kid. Uh, Violet is my favorite non-romanceable. I like Thomas too a lot. Sophia seems nice too. We just need to meet one more character. I can't believe I just interrupted their lesson, like, midday. I mean, you know what, though? It's the mayor's fault. The mayor, like, made me do it. The icebreaker quest. Oh, what's this? <gasps> Tool shed? Vegetable patch? Oh, so eventually you can... You can change or upgrade from garden beds? Maybe you can have both? You can upgrade the tool shed? That's cool. Hey, Parker. Quick question. Did the mayor make you play a game to meet everyone when you first moved here? Well, Otto wasn't mayor back then. It was Violet's dad, Antonio Miranda. And no, Violet's I don't dad. Think he asked me to do that. It might have been useful, come to think about it. Some folks are harder to get to know than others. Okay, cool. Um, we'll go to the woods. I like the woods, it's pretty. Always need garden beds, but you get more space to put them. Oh, that's nice. And I can get more mushrooms, too.
This looks like a an enchanted forest. It's so pretty. I don't see anyone here. But this is who I'm looking for, right? Shelby? I don't think I've met Shelby. Give me the mushy. I keep wanting to pick this mushy right here. Oh! Can you hear that? It's like sparkling noises. This must be a magic tree. This must be a magic tree. Is there fast travel in this game? Does anyone know? Like eventually? Or like, do I get a bike? Do I, can I at least take my heels off? <laughs> you can check the beach. I need to find Shelby. I need to meet all the characters. We can't have our first impressions of the characters without meeting them all. There is? Cool. That's all I wanted to know. Just if that's something I can look forward to or if I have to run around like... Oh, this is... I love this diner. I love diner vibes. Like the old school diners. If you can't find diners. me at my stall, I'll be by the lake in the woods or the beach. Anywhere I can catch I think I like mind. Bruno. Well, and Damon's pop. As a character. But all I catch there is grief from Otto for staying out too late. <laughs> uh, Sandra, hello, hello. Thanks for stopping in to say hi. Okay. I'm looking for Shelby. It's very important. Or the cat again. You know what? Oh, is this Shelby? Hi, I'm Tara. I just moved to town. You look just like I pictured. I'm sorry, what? Oh, uh, being Hazel's granddaughter, I mean. Oh, and you are? Been many things, but if it's a name you're looking for, I met everyone. folks here call me Shelby. Aww. Such a, like, nice voice. Oh, you're selling stuff? Shelby's scraps. I can get a pine cone. Oh, I can wait, do I have a pine cone? I didn't even know I had a pine cone. Interesting. A mandrake. Right, I forgot mandrakes are a real thing. <laughs> we learned that on a stream. I forget what game that was where we learned that mandrakes are real. Oh, let's go get my prize after all that. Yeah, I need my prize. Okay, so... Interesting. I'm trying to think if there's any characters I'm interested in. I'm mostly interested in getting to know, like, the, just the characters as people so far. They seem really interesting. They seem like they have interesting stories and personalities. Um, okay, let's go get our prize. I hope it's something good. I hope it's not like, oh, your prize is the prize of friendship. You now met everyone. And friendship is priceless. I mean, it is, but like, I just don't want to hear that from the mayor, you know? <laughs> like, I feel like the mayor should give me an actual prize. Love how diverse the voice acting cast is. True. There's some nice variety for sure. Okay, hi. 
I didn't. Wonderful. I did the quest. The last citizen has let me know that you've been introduced. As promised, here is your reward for playing the game. What do I get? Game. We hope it helped you acclimatize. Money. Uh, thanks. Uh, money's great too, though. Sweet. That's good. Money's a good prize. <laughs> Take care, Sandra. Money's a good prize, especially because I only have now 65 coins. Okay. So now what do I have to do? Eat something? Oh, I guess I'll actually eat. Wait for your potatoes. Eat. Okay. I did that. Return to grandma. Okay. I was saving it because I was like, I don't really need to... I don't really need to replenish my stamina, but I guess it was part of an actual quest, so... Let's go talk to grandma. The mayor looks like a bobblehead toy! <laughs> what does this mayor do all day exactly? Jendon looks like... He like tosses his pen up in the air. And catches it again. Grandma, I ate the soup. It was delicious. See, a bit of food now I want like a real mushroom soup. Your energy is low, and then you're right as rain. For a while, you still need plenty of sleep. Even my cooking is no match for a good night's rest. But Grandma, you're the one who should be resting. I don't want you troubling yourself to cook for me. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Is that your way of trying to get my recipe book? No. Did Sophia put you up to it? She's always trying to get a peek at my recipes, but you can tell her they stay in the family. Oh my I goodness. Hide my recipe book in the <laughs> stove. She never thinks to look in there. <laughs> That's dangerous. Go on, try one. Okay. Well, which one is your favorite? I am quite partial Ooh, to mushroom, mushroom risotto. risotto. <gasps> I love risotto. Buy rice and collect mushrooms so you can make grandma's favorite dish. Okay, let's go buy some rice. She keeps her recipe book in the stove? How is it not set on fire yet? Also, the fact that she's like, oh, are you snooping for Sophia? No, grandma. Do you not trust me? I just don't want- I'm trying to take care of grandma. I don't want grandma to stress over cooking me food. Okay, rice. General store, I'm guessing. Mayor eats peanuts all day. <laughs> Mayor seems sus. I agree. Uh, Goku, hello, hello. Welcome in. Dylan, thank you for lurking. Hi, I need some rice, please. Um, rice. Thanks. Rice and shine. I wonder what the statue is supposed to be. I want this little ant. Look at this cute little animal. Look at it. I want it. I want the animals. Fern says, how does grandma know I like Sophia? <laughs> Grandmas always know. Grandmas always know. For some reason, Tara running around reminds me of that meme that's like, I have little legs. Because I feel like it's such a long way for Tara to run. Okay. I got the rice. I got the rice. I think I have everything we need. Now I've written down the recipe here. Head on over to the stove. Give it a try. Okay. Oh, I get to actually cook now? Hooray! We can make mushroom risotto. There's cooking in this game. Uh, oh, look! We can make sushi? Coconut rice? Cauliflower soup? Mmm. This is gonna make me- <gasps> Restorative tea? A berry smoothie? Okay, I'm officially hungry. Officially hungry. We're gonna make that. Definitely gonna have to get a snack on my break. When is, like, when are we not hungry on stream? It'd be easier to, like, count the number of times we're not hungry. Because there's always, like, good food in these games, I feel like. Okay, here's the risotto. I made it. Here's your mushroom risotto. 
Oh, thank you, honeybee. It smells wonderful. But you made enough for yourself, I hope. I hope so. I'm hungry. I hope I made enough for both of us. Cool. Okay, I watered my plants. I made the risotto. Yeah, wait for me. I got little legs. That one. <laughs> uh, Goku, thank you for lurking. I really want to know what's going on here. I'll have to wait and find out. I also really want crystals. I'll have to wait for those too. It's a collapsed mine shaft. <laughs> want to fix like it? I can't get into it until it's fixed. Cisco says I'm having a cacao and banana smoothie. Cheese, you're hungry too. Ah, oh, what are we gonna do about that? We're gonna have to all go get snacks on my break. I don't know what I'm gonna have. I don't even know what I have. I think I have like a green juice, but I don't think I want like a green juice. I think I want like something to actually eat. Normally I just have a banana, but like I want something like savory now with all this food talk. Hey, can you fix up the the mine thing for me, please? I want crystals. Hello again. Hi. You know, you don't see many blacksmiths these days. Yeah, I know. Well, my great-grandpa was a blacksmith, so I guess you could say it runs in the family. Of course, he died before I was born, but it's his hammer I've got. That's really cool. So your family taught you? Oh, nah. I'm self-taught. A city export like yourself. It's harder work than sitting Walker at a Walker wouldn't want the green juice either. Rewarding. True. I'll come to love it here. I'll see. I really like green juice. I just feel like I want to actually eat something, you know? A poke bowl. Yum. Oh yeah, I needed the... What do I... I needed stuff for this. Do I have the stuff for it? I can make a paper press. But maybe I need... My wood for something else. A breakfast burrito. Is YouTube broken? Yeah, probably. If you're ever wondering if YouTube's having an issue, it probably is. <laughs> oh my gosh, she says it's my- uh, Today is my fourth year wedding anniversary with my partner and I need to finish setting up the house and cooking. Cheese, congratulations! Uh, thanks for hanging out for a while. Have a lovely rest of your time zone. Enjoy every moment, take care. That's amazing. Okay, I need to fix this up. What do I need to fix this up? Oh no, I'm stuck. I don't think I can fix this up yet. If I just collect more wood, then I'll be fine because I'll have extra. Uh, Suzanne, thank you so much for the sub. Welcome in. Oh, there's the weed. I haven't got any weed yet. Weeds. I haven't got any weeds yet. I thought I was collecting weeds with the thistle or whatever it was I was picking up. I thought these were decorations. <laughs> I thought these were decorations, okay? Not... <laughs> You guys are funny. You guys are funny. All right, my crafting table is over here too. I have two crafting tables. Oh my gosh, I'm overwhelmed. In a good way. I can make this. Turns weed, weeds into soil for new garden beds. Oh, this is cool. You can place it exactly where you want it. In this grid. So I understand you would expand this plot. I get it. I get it. Okay. Good. Soil. Craft. Soil. 24 hours. Now that must be in game, right? There's no way that's IRL. That's gotta be in game. Uh, 
I'm ignoring chat. <laughs> I'm ignoring you guys. I don't know how this happened. How did we get here? Oh, I need two more wood for this. I really want to make this paper press. Uh, Romina, hello. Uh, no yams, hello. Twenty-four hours in game. Okay. So I was gonna say, there's no way that's in real life. I want to make the paper press. <sighs> We're making a paper press. Look. I can make my own paper. Isn't that cool? How do I make it? With wood! I can make different kinds of paper. Oh, I haven't unlocked those ones yet. Let's make some paper. Cool. Wait, do I just get it automatically? Oh yeah, you just get it. Cool. I don't know what I'm going to do with the paper, but... I made paper. <laughs> I think it started when Sarah said she was harvesting weeds. Yeah. Well, I didn't know that's what they were. I thought I was already harvesting the weeds. Um, like... Wait, where even is it? Oh, I used them. I used them for the compost. I thought the thistle counted as a weed. The witch weed definitely counts as a weed. But I now understand there's like specific weed weeds that are not different kinds of weeds. And I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Look at- Okay, I want these mice so bad. Can I have them as pets? Does anyone know if I can have them as pets? <laughs> I'm guessing I cannot. Okay, I've done all my quests for the day. I'm still waiting for my potatoes to grow. Only weeds count as weeds? What? Only weeds count as weeds. You can't have them as pets, but they do stick around even after you fix the barn and coop? Oh, that's good. That's good news for me. That's really good Good news for me. I gotta get used to this map. Oh, here's a mushy. Okay. Bedtime. I'm going to bed at 6 p.m. because I've done everything <laughs> for the day. I think. Let's talk to Grandma. I just love the peace here. I wish I could pet the mice. Yes, that's why I've never moved anywhere else. They just look cute. Do you think that's strange? No, Grandma. I think it's peaceful here too. Well, maybe we're both strange. <laughs> it's good to be strange, right? It's boring to be normal. Oh, am I ready for bed? Yeah, I'm ready for bed. It's been a long day. I'm tired. Let's get some taros in the chat. She just goes to sleep in her full, her full fit. The whole dress and heels and everything. She doesn't change into PJs. Oh my goodness, bless you. Oh, are your allergies acting up? Oh, no, it's all the dust in the front room. But sweeping makes my back ache. So I've turned a blind eye for no months now. But that's exactly what I'm here to help with, Grandma. Then would you mind showing those dust bunnies the front door? There's a broom in my room you can use. You wait out here. Those dust bunnies have no idea what's coming for them. I thought dust bunnies were real critters for the... Longest time to move this rug to make real headway. As as a kid. Whoa! 
Is that <gasps> a trap door? door? Jeez, Grandma. Wait, what is happening? What are you keeping down there? So the trap door under the rug. Hmm. What is it for? Preserves and pickles, or old machinery? It's not important, honeybee. Would you be out and about tonight? Probably, but what do you mean not important? Could you fetch me some moonflower? Distractions, distractions. The sunset. You'll know it by the white blossoms. See, my moonflower tea blend makes me feel so healthy. I get a blush on these old cheeks. Go right past Parker's workshop into the woods and you'll find what you need. I feel like I'm getting redirected here. I, at my age, it's awfully okay. hard to hear certain things. Did you put the rug back in place? Yes, <laughs> Grandma, but... Uh, but are you brewing moonshine down there? You can tell me if you're brewing moonshine. What is happening? Mm, I can already taste Grandma's like acting like I'm not. That was normal. Okay, moonflowers. She's acting like, okay, now it's covered back up. Okay, that was super weird. It's where she keeps the weeds she forages, Jack. <laughs> it seems like it, right? Let me just water my crops. I think we're gonna have to um, move on to the next game. As much as I've only scratched the surface of this one. Um, my first impression so far, if you're interested, I actually think in this early game, I didn't necessarily need to have it on the slowest speed because I think like normal might've been best for maybe the maybe after the first day because I had so much extra time. Um, I mean, there's probably other stuff I could have done too, but I do like that you can change the time. I like the character so far. Uh, the story seems interesting. I actually personally don't mind that we're playing as Terra. I thought I really would because I like customizing my own character, but I actually don't mind too much. However, I could see how um, that could impact uh, your preference to play for sure. Um, other than that, I really like the look of what we're gonna be able to craft. Um, it seems like there's a lot to do in this game, like farming, mining, foraging, uh, animals eventually. Um, like there's crystals, you can make candles, like you can make a ton of stuff. So I definitely think if you want to sink your time into a game, I feel like this one could offer a lot. So those are just my very, very first impressions. That's where the special mushies grow, Fern. <laughs> Don't pester grandma with questions, mind your own business. Okay, okay, I'm just curious why there's like a literal trap door in grandma's house. Uh, Aegis says I tend to swap the time from relaxed to normal and back. I could see that depending on like what you're doing that day. It could be nice to have like extra time and then other days it could be nice to just have like a more, not even a quick pace, but just like a kind of like a regular day. Um, Wildflowers has an amazing storyline. I know I can see that. I can see that already. So I definitely would like to play this some more. Um, but yeah, so far so good are my impressions. So definitely if you're interested, you could check it out. You could check it out if you like what you see. But again, I think I only scratched the surface. So there's likely like a ton, a ton more to explore. So next up is Lakeburg Legacies. Um, no idea what to expect from that one, but I've heard some really good things about it. So I'm excited. I think it's going to be pretty fun. Um, I'm going to take my break to get a snack and switch over the game. So you guys can use this time as well to maybe grab a snack or a drink stretch your legs do whatever you need to do and then we will meet back here in about five minutes and we'll check out lakeburg legacies and i'll also be giving away a key for lakeburg legacies um so that's exciting too so yeah i'll be right back you guys
Welcome back, everyone. Welcome back, welcome back. I hope you all got some delicious snacks and beverages. I did have a banana. So I'm feeling less hungry now <laughs> and excited to check out Lakeburg Legacies. We have a special emote today for this game. It is the stork, as you can see, it's very cute. Pikmin 4 comes out tomorrow, right? Oh my gosh, I'm excited. We're playing Pikmin 4 on the member stream this week, which will be lots of fun. Uh, I'm very excited. Ocelot, hello, hello. Love the aesthetic of this game already. Okay, so. Yes, let me focus here. So. Lakeburg Legacies. The, the reason I said it's a little different for me is because it's a social-based village management sim. And in the game, love is like the resource you use, I guess. So you play matchmaker to create effective and loving couples to help the kingdom thrive. Uh, the game just released today. Um, and I do have an extra Steam key for the game to be giving away. So if you're interested in a chance to win, you just need to comment on the video once the stream, you know, turns into a video. You just need to leave a comment with your favorite stream memory of the day and you'll be entered to win. Uh, thank you so much to Ishtar Games for providing me with a key to play and another key to give away to one of you. Appreciate it so much. I'm uh, very excited to check this out. I've heard really good things, uh, both from you guys and some of my uh, fellow creator friends. So I'm very excited to check it out. Uh, let's just jump in. I don't exactly know what to expect. Okay, we already have some things we have to decide on. So, oh, it's like you pick a duration. Okay. So short is 30 years. Classic is 75 and long is 100 years. Should we just do classic maybe? Regular game style, relationships between villagers, resource production and service gauges will require a similar investment. Uh, Travis, thank you so much for the sub. Welcome in. A social, oh wait, regular, social, custom. Okay, maybe we're just gonna do I think I'm just gonna stick with regular. I'm not gonna do anything too crazy um, for my first time trying it out. Uh, it's cool that there's different like game modes. I feel like that offers a lot of replayability. Uh, Ipara, hello, hello, welcome in. Dyson, hello, welcome in. Yeah, we're just starting Lakeburg Legacies. So welcome in, perfect timing. Uh, there was a demo out for this game, which I never played, uh, but that's how I heard all the good things from the community, so. Okay. Apprentice. Oh, are these like different? Like make it easier? Maybe I'll just keep it, I think I might just keep it all untouched. I don't know, I don't wanna play around with things too much cause then I might, I don't know. I don't know, I'm just gonna leave it. Oh, and a tutorial, I need the tutorial. Yes, I want a tutorial, please. Definitely interested in this. I'm very interested in this game. It's a little out of my comfort zone, but I think I'm just going to leave everything, you know, standard, not mess with it, and we'll get into it. Creating some drama. Putting lovers in cupboards. Wait, what? <laughs> Old lovers patching things up. This is so funny already. Spreading some rumors? Okay, I hope you all have tea. I actually literally got tea. More tea on the break, so. <laughs> uh, Alicia, hello, hello. Here for the drama, telenovela, here we come. I'm ready for it too. Oh, this music is very, um. Triumphant. I'm ready. I'm ready. Shearing sheep. Wait, what was that about? <laughs> Shearing sheep. Grabbing some pitchforks. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound good. That doesn't sound good. Grabbing the pitchforks. Yeah, it's like a matchmaking social management kind of game, Cherry. I, I have the tutorial because I definitely need it. Okay. 
We're getting comfy. I'm getting comfy. Okay. Welcome to Lakeburg, my child. My name is Tindra, and I'm a psychic. Like my mother and her mother before her, I'm an expert in lonely hearts. I just love weddings. Spicing up other people's lives and finding them a soulmate is my whole life. Wow. What did I just hear? I just heard like a bird or something. A vision led me to this godforsaken... hole? Wait, what? <laughs> With a little luck and a lot of seduction, Lakeburg can become a true haven of love. And you, you will assist me with this goal. What? Yes, you were in my vision. And now we've got work to do. You'll find my cart nearby, so knock on my door when you find someone to marry. Okay, wow. They're not holding back. <laughs> the music is giving Witcher vibes. I've never played The Witcher, actually. I'd like to, though, one day. Uh, Jessica, hello, hello, welcome in. Allow me to introduce Victoria, your first villager, whose descent will form the very foundation of Lakeburg. Let us find her an occupation. Hey, let's put her in the Lumberjack's Lodge. Okay. In order to produce higher quantities, Lumberjacks must have good athletic skills. In order to produce quickly, Lumberjacks must have good strength stat. Lumberjacks will be happier if they belong to the peasants class. The impact on their morale will be reduced. Wait. So, okay. Wait, wait, where does it say peasants? Oh, here, this little thing, the wheat? Future villagers will be sorted depending on their potential. Workers per potential to work in the displayed building. Is that the stars? That must be the stars. Drag and drop the villager on the working slot. Okay. Um, so here. Now let me start the clock again. Let us wait for Victoria to finish chopping her first batch of wood. Okay. Oh, it's like 87 day. Wait, 87 days. Isn't the whole game 100 or 75 days? Wait, what? <laughs> uh, Alira, hello, hello, welcome in. Oh my gosh, this music. It's great. I just need to turn it down for myself a bit. Okay. Do I just wait? 75 years. It's been 75 years. I just wait, I guess. Oh my gosh, it's March 27th, 28th, 29th, 30th. Okay, we got 10 pieces of wood. Wait. The time is just going by. Wait, 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 stop it. Pause it. What is happening? It's just going. <laughs> Let me out of here. <laughs> okay, character sheet. We just... Wait, no, pause. Stop. <laughs> The time is going by so quickly. I don't know what I'm doing yet. Was that all for the tutorial? Okay, wait, Victoria, Lumberjack, 22 years old. Potential. I don't know what any of these things are. Stats. Aspiration is food. Okay. Homeless? Wait, don't you have a, didn't I give you a home? Oh my gosh, there's so many stats. Relationships? Okay! Okay, likes dueling, hobbies. Oh, music. Likes dueling, music, and cuddles. Dislikes. Okay. Dislikes treats? Poetry? And public executions. Okay, let's put them in a house somewhere. <laughs> With a bit of elbow grease. I mean, that's a good sign. That's a... A green flag. Red flag on the no treats. With a bit of elbow grease, one can achieve great things. 
Build a house and enter it. Okay. Build. Um, I can't build another one. Okay, you go in here. That's your house. Oh. This is where you'll make your home sweet home. Okay, you own it. All right, this is getting boring. Let us find the perfect partner for Victoria. Send her to me from the village. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's May 4th. So go back to the village. Village. One single villager looking for love. I just have to get the hang of this, you guys. The character traits can get pretty quirky. I kind of like that though. Uh, Travis, hello, hello, welcome in. So, farewell singleness, hello coupledom. Go here. Find your soulmate. You can choose the suitors, you can choose the suitors gender in Lakeburg. Villagers have no sexual preferences and gay couples can adopt children. For now, Victoria is alone in town. We need to broaden our field of research. Okay, ask me to present her with some people living in our future village's surroundings. Surroundings. The most important ingredient for a lasting relationship is to find someone with whom your villager has a good affinity. That way, the ideal suitor will share the same likes and dislikes as your maid. Wait, what? Affinity. Average. It's important to remember the suitor's likes or dislikes so you know what topics to bring up during dates. I have to do that. <laughs> I have to do that. I'd be more worried if she liked public execution. I agree, Cherry. That's what I'm saying. It's a, it's a green flag that she doesn't like it. I love the inclusivity for the relationship building. I agree. I agree. I agree. After the wedding, the suitor will move into Lakeburg. Don't forget to make sure they're a good recruit. Now it's time to make your choice. I only ask for a few hearts to fuel my crystal ball and propose a new suitor. So if I want... If I want to try again, I have to sacrifice hearts. Or if I accept this one, they go on a date. Okay. Likes likes public executions okay this is not gonna go well this is not gonna go well we're gonna use our hearts for new this is not a good match Aww. no what dislikes muscles i'm gonna be using all my hearts here this is not good red flag okay likes poetry dislikes poetry <sighs> Dislikes meditation and flowers. I don't know about this because this is like, okay, average affinity. The problem here is that Alice really likes poetry and Victoria dislikes poetry. So I feel like that's not going to go well. I don't know. I, I'm going to keep, I'm going to re-roll. Likes poetry again? Can you guys just not like poetry, please? Oh. Likes treats? I'm gonna use all my hearts just trying to find someone who doesn't like- Because if they like something that Victoria dislikes, it's just not gonna work, right? It's just not gonna work. Okay, wait, here we go. Here we go. This is looking good. Excellent affinity. We have Odolin. I was wondering, is your is your mother an oyster by any chance? Pearls like you are so rare. Okay, okay, okay. Likes dueling, likes dueling. They can duel. Dislikes treats. They both dislike treats, that's perfect. Dislikes gossip. Dislikes mussels. Likes the countryside and flowers. I think this is a good a good match. I'm glad I used all those hearts. Okay, so yes. We're gonna pick Odolin. Odolin is our winner. Just get her a cat instead. <laughs> I'm 
Miss Kitty, Miss Kitty says this game is as bad at choosing partners as I am. That's so funny. I, I wonder, like, there must be a lot of combinations, right? I hope you remember your suitor's hobbies. <gasps> okay, hold on. Flowers. Dueling. What was the other one? I don't remember. Oh no. The aim is to bring up the topics they like and share their dislikes. Failing that, staying on neutral ground is a safe bet. Oh no. I didn't know I had to remember. Okay, hold on. I know they like dueling, so there's that. This is ye old, like ye old Tinder, Dyson. <laughs> Uh, Dyson says, I wish we could go back to older par potential partners, but this is like you old Tinder. Swipe away and they're gone. It's so true. It's like a one one chance. Was it dancing? Yeah, I need a notepad. I need a notepad. We need to take notes. The countryside. Yes, that's what it was. Uh, if you have a memory lapse, my crystal ball can help you. Okay. With, for 50 hearts, I only have 189. Okay, so, Victoria and Odalyn both enjoy the pale moonlight. This unique moment allows them to get to know each other better. Accuse fat stray cats for every problem happening in the village? Who wrote this? Propose the idea of picking some flowers in the fields? Let's try this one. Well done. This marriage is in the bag. Let the two lovebirds continue dating so they strengthen their love before tying the knot for life, if they so wish. That's so quick. What a romantic idea. Odalyn is enchanted. Okay, so that went well. Let's continue this charming rendezvous with a nice bottle. Okay. Victoria and Odalyn are spending time at the inn, emptying a few glasses. Will the warm atmosphere help them break the ice? Muscles are the true pinnacle of human evolution. I remember Odalyn does not like muscles. Right? Yes, we should put storks in the chat when we we succeed at something. It's so cute, that little emote. Uh, shout out to Cisco for it, of course. It's so cute. I remember Odalyn does not like muscles. So I have to go with this one. Worrying that books may corrupt the young? What are these two options even? I guess we'll go with this one though, because I definitely know... I'm pretty sure, unless I'm mixing Odalyn up with someone else, I'm pretty sure they said they do not like muscles. So, we're gonna try this one. Aww. Yes! Oh, it turned into a crystal heart! That's so cute! As it is, the young spend too much time at school. They should spend less time reading and more time working. Oh no. <laughs> Everything seems to be fine. Say, what about a boat ride on the lake? Oh, let's go for a boat ride. Oh, this one's, wait. Okay, Victoria and Odalyn are enjoying a boat ride on the lake's tranquil waters. Considering how romantic it is, would it now be the ideal time to go for it? Okay. So... I'm pretty sure Odalyn does not like gossip. And this says gossips are a plague on any civilized society. So that would be in alignment with Odalyn's values, I think. Talk about favorite songs. I don't remember anything about music or favorite songs from the, the bio. So I might, oh, I think it was Oh gosh, I really should be taking notes. She likes music. What if we don't have the same favorite songs though? I'm not sure what to do because I feel like they could both. Hmm. Should I do a, like a coin toss? She didn't like gossip, right? That was for sure. I'm pretty sure that was... Was there a wide range of music genres back then? That's a good question. 
Oh, I don't know which one to do. Um, I kind of want to... Oh, this is such a negative thing to like bring up though, instead of favorite songs. I could ask Tindra. I don't know if I want to spend 50 hearts though, because I, I feel like I need my hearts to re-roll on couples. Unless that was like all the re-rolling I have to do. Just pick. I'm just going to go with this one. I'm going to go with... If this is the moment, we have to go with something positive, right? We don't want to be like, this is gossiping kind of, right? Odalyn isn't too fussed about music. What's important is, when there are bards, there is usually beer. Okay, good to know. <laughs> it's a match! Let us rejoice. We are gathered here today to celebrate the union between- Oh my gosh, they're already getting married? They're already getting married? That was so quick. <laughs> we did it! Look at I love these are crystals. Wait, every two months, there's a chance of having a baby from 2% to 6%? Wait, what? <laughs> every two months? Let us rejoice. We are gathered here today to celebrate the union between Victoria and Odalyn. Do you promise each other love, honesty, and fidelity until death do you part? I do. By the powers vested in me today, I hereby declare you both as officially wedded. You may kiss. Let the party begin. Congratulations. Congratulations on Victoria and Odalyn's wedding. We need some storks in the chat. <laughs> some high level gaming, absolutely. This is pro gamer stuff for sure. <laughs> the ship name is Octoria. That's so funny. Uh, now I'm counting on you to make Lakeburg grow for the years to come. Have the village thrive and become as prestigious as possible. Here's a list of objectives to achieve so you can increase your prestige score. I will reward you for your investment. Whatever happens, remember to have at least one villager around so Lakeburg doesn't become some ghost town. If you find it difficult to follow everything happening in Lakeburg all at once, you can use filters to monitor specific details or display information by level of importance. Uh, so far, I was in charge of time, but now it's your turn. You can make it go faster or pause it. I feel like I have to remember to pause it. Uh, right, I'll go now, recruit new people, marry them, and forge long-lasting relationships. Okay, pause the time instantly. I gotta look at the UI for a second. The gameplay is unreal. <laughs> uh, yes, a very quick wedding. Dyson says, storked about Octoria. May they stay together and no drama in their future. I hope they're happy too. Okay, so now... What is this? Unemployed. Okay, Odalyn, we need to get you a job. What do we even have going on here? Odalyn and Victoria have met and now share the following relationship. Infatuated. Odalyn and Victoria have met and now share the relationship. Loveless marriage? Wait, which one's first? Why is it a loveless marriage? Okay, we need to get you a job. How do I get you a job? I can't do that. Uh, you can build three different groups of buildings by using resources. Each of these groups follows a definite order. For instance, to build a hunter's cabin, you must first build a farm. Okay, so what do we need to build? A farm? We need 30 wood? Oh my gosh. Okay, Victoria, get to work. We need some wood. We need some wood. Let's play the time. I need the wood. There we go. 10 wood. Pause it again. <laughs> I don't want like years and years to go by and I'm just like... Spoke too soon, I guess. Loveless marriage? Yeah, I don't understand. Okay, let's... Oh, I need 30 wood. Okay. We need 30 wood. So... Play. Oh my gosh. Event. A sticky brew. Odalyn and Victoria have been chatting for hours at the inn. Suddenly, Victoria poured her beer on Odalyn, completely soaking the poor soul. How will she react? Laugh. 
laugh. Seeing Odalyn laugh merrily at her clumsiness, Victoria apologized with a smile. Covered in sticky beer, Odalyn offered her to come to her place to take a bath. Wait, don't they? Aren't they married? Oh my. Maybe that'll infuse some love into their... There we go. They're in love now. <laughs> That's all it took. They're, they're in love now. Can you work here too? No, I have to buy a worker slot? Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, so I stepped away and came back to Sarah asking why it's a loveless marriage. I didn't understand. They had good affinity. I guess this is if I n need a new couple. Neighbors? Next recruitment in two months? Oh my gosh, look how quick the days are going by. Look at that. I literally just need more wood. I need 30 pieces of wood. And then I can maybe give Odalyn a job on the farm? Would that work? Marriage was weird back in the day. I guess so. How do we get more villagers? I guess by people randomly coming in. Like, it looks like we're going to get someone else here in a matter of seconds. And then maybe children being had? I'm not sure. Uh, Shannon, thank you for lurking. Just took one spilled beer to reignite the passion, right? That's all it took. Oh, some neighbors showed up in Lakeburg. They seem to want to settle here. Cool. They both look sad. <laughs> Lakeburg is in need of manpower. Check out the profiles of potential future recruits and choose the best one to make your village thrive. If you don't like the current profiles, you may ask another neighbor to apply. Okay. You can also wait for other people to show up spontaneously at the village. Okay, pause the time while I think. Do we want Florence or do we want Dagobert? Okay, Florence is a miner, a prankster. <laughs> <laughs> and a carpenter. Oh, but Dagobert is a farmer and I want to build a farm. So this would be useful. Right? Shows the worker's efficiency as a farmer. And a livestock farmer and a seamster. But I want a prankster. <laughs> but I think having... I think having a farmer would be helpful because I want to build a farm. So that follows with my... It cost me eight coins to recruit them. Vital needs? Bad. We're doing bad. <laughs> Heat, feed, and dress. Okay, we're gonna go with Dagobert. I've never heard that name before in my life. Welcome in, Dagobert. Hope you're ready to be a farmer. 19? Okay, Dagobert likes... Wait, wait, whoops. When two villagers share a relationship, the latter can evolve positively or I missed the first thing. Um... May also change groups. To create a relationship between two villagers or make it evolve, you may have them greet each other. Now the result isn't foolproof. Oh, so if we want them to, like, be friends or something? Okay, likes fishing, dueling, and treats. Dislikes flowers, reading, and gossip. Okay, good to know. Uh, do we have enough wood? Oh, wait, I'm not ready to pair them up yet. Let's get, get a farm going. Oh, I need to make a house, too, for Dagobert. Dagobert has nowhere to live. But I need... No, I want a farm. I guess I have to make them a house first. No, I can make the farm. Let's make the farm. Let's build a farm. Sarah, you should give Dagobert a home. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> 19 with that beard, right? I wasn't expecting it. Okay, here, Dagobert, you can live here. I mean, you can live here. Available for a couple. Okay, but we don't have anyone else here that you can couple up with yet. So we're gonna pump the brakes on that one. We are going to build a farm. 
Oh, perfect. Um, and then we are going to... Who want You want to work here. How do I make you work here? You're going to work here. As a farmer. Perfect. Okay, I think that's all I need to do, right? There's so many numbers on the screen. <laughs> uh, Jen didn't take care. Thanks so much for hanging out. We'll see you again soon. Okay, so we have the farm and the lumberjacks lodge. Neighbors, there's another. Oh, we can recruit another person. Wait, let's pause the time again. Oh my gosh. Manon? Manon? Painter, baker, dancer? Mary is a teacher, prankster, carpenter. Oh. A baker could be useful. So could a teacher if we start having kids. Carpenter as well. Crafting, intelligence, strength, knowledge, dexterity, stage. I think I'm going to go with Mary. I feel like we need Mary. We need Mary skills. You like the name? Ma Is it Menon? I like a French name. I like the name too. Sorry, Menon. I took Mary instead. Unemployed. Okay. Now what? Now you need a house too. I need more wood. We need. Can I employ another lumberjack? Oh yeah, I need a lot of wood though for that. I feel like I should employ another lumberjack because we need lots of wood to do all these things. Free student slot. Each mentor can supervise up to three students. Oh, okay. Mentoring young delinquents can be tough depending on the number of students your mentor has a chance to be stressed out. Oh. Okay. How do I- so I can add a student here? It won't let me click on that. Okay, maybe I can't yet. Maybe I need like kids or something. This is very complex, it is. Uh, AJ take care, thanks for hanging out. Couples? Oh my gosh, what's happening? Uh... Najarine, thank you so much for the sub. Welcome in. How do I... I want to make a couple. Oh, villagers. Here we go. Okay. Um, how about... Find your soulmate. Okay. There are several single villagers in Lakeburg, but don't worry. I'd never propose members of one's own family. Okay, thank you. Good. Choose gender. Mixed. Oh my gosh, there's so many options. Surroundings. I want to pick someone. I don't want someone from the... From Lakeburg. There's only a few people right now. Let's get someone from the surroundings. Okay. We're matching up another couple. Okay. The kids could be the student apprentices in each occupation. Okay, that makes sense. A little bit of cozy chaos, absolutely. Okay, okay, okay. So we need, this is good affinity. Uh, commonly dislike fishing. Izor, would you grab my arm so I can tell my friends I've been touched by an angel? <laughs> you know what? I think this is a good match right off the bat, right here. Fisher, Huntress, Croupier. What is a croupier? Um, okay, but we have to remember this, okay? Likes fashion, countryside, kittens. <gasps> they like kittens? I'm writing this down. This is important. Fashion, countryside, kittens. 10 out of 10. Dislikes fishing, flowers. <laughs> And divination. Okay, interesting. 
I like the flirting lines, they're so fun. Okay, we're gonna do this. Go on a date. A fisher that dislikes fishing. Wait. <laughs> That's so true. That's so funny. Uh, Mary and Izor are spending time at the inn, emptying a few glasses. Will the warm atmosphere help them break the ice? Okay, so... Definitely not this one because they like the countryside. So nothing said about poetry. Let's try this. Roses are red, violets are blue. I live in a small shed and I really love you. <laughs> a small shed? Mary, I, I made you a nice house. What do you mean you live in a small shed? I thought I built you a house. We need some storks in the chat. Okay. Phase one has been a success. Phase two. Okay, boat ride on the lake. Accuse fat stray cats for every problem? No, we can't do that one because they love kittens. The gargantuan display of food at the last banquet. Banquet was simply disgusting. Okay, well, they didn't say anything about food, so we can try this one. Nice. Uh, thanks to constant reminders that the poor barely have enough to eat, Izor tends to avoid stuffing themselves like a pig. Okay. Uh, what about going up the hill to enjoy the moonlight? This is the big moment, chat. This is three of three. Let's see if we can do this. Okay. Uh... <laughs> what if we abolished the death penalty and flowers are pointless? Um, Izor does not like flowers, so we can try this. Concerned about allergies, Izor will never let flowers enter her house. Did we do it? It's a match! It's a match, you guys! Storks in the chat, storks in the chat. A wedding. Let us rejoice. Yes, I do. I do. You may kiss. Congratulations. Okay, we have another couple. So. Oh my gosh, they need a house. Wait, I didn't make him a. <laughs> I didn't make him a house. I made Dagobert a house. Mary, I'm sorry you're living in a shed. I was like, I thought he was just like, uh, being ungrateful. Okay, we need more. We need more wood. Okay, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Charles vibes for the allergies, totally. Okay, let's um fix this. So, you both live here. This is where you can follow the events of a couple's daily life. The higher the affinity between both spouses, the more likely the impact on their love will be positive. It's possible to give a couple's love a little boost with a gift. Oh my gosh, there's so much to do in this game. Love is divided into steps? If its level falls to zero, the couple will automatically break up? Oh my gosh, okay. Um, the, the couple will produce more or less hearts and prestige according to its love step. That very love will determine the couple's chance of spontaneously having a child. Okay. So I don't get to ask them to have a child, they just do it. If you want a couple to become parents, you need to have one child room ready. Okay. Oh, I can decide a little bit. Okay. I can say yes or no to babies. Look at there's the emote. If the waiting really becomes unbearable, you can spend a few hearts to have a child join the household a few months later. If a couple is at its wit's end, you may decide to facilitate a breakup. Oh my gosh. Okay, sure, you guys can have a, a baby if you want. I don't really care. Mary really was in a shed. I genuinely didn't think that I did that. So wait, are these ones living together? Yeah, so how's their love going? Victoria remembered, wait, pause the time. Uh, 
Uh, Yoda, hello, hello, welcome in. Remember their birthday, that's good. Victoria trusts Odolin entirely. Looked at Victoria with such, such intensity, it made her blush. Okay, so they're doing well. They're doing well. How do I add a room for a kid? Remove filter, homeless. Oh, whoops. Oh, I can toggle between... Got it. Oh, unlock a room. A child slot, got it. So I need more wood. It always comes back to the wood. Everyone's unemployed too! <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, everyone's unemployed. No, 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 not neighbors. I need... Can I build anything else? No. Oh my gosh, everyone's unemployed here and I have no more slots to... I need to unlock this one. Okay, wait, let me play the time. Because I need more wood. Enjoy Coral Island, that's awesome. So excited for the next update, oh my gosh. Okay, so there's like random social interactions. Villagers meet and interact. Okay, cool. So what just happened? What is this? <gasps> Wait, what? What? Why? They're disgusted? Why are you disgusted with each other? How about greet? You guys are together. Aren't they together? Am I. What is happening? Baby wish obsessed. Their love seems good. Why are, why were they disgusted with each other? I don't understand. Okay, so everyone has a home. Right? That's good. You guys too busy? I I could see that. There's a lot going on. Not the 80% unemployment rate. Oh no. <laughs> Look at the time just ticking by too. I'm literally just waiting to have enough wood to bring another person in. Maybe I can pair up. Uh, a baby's on the way? Oh my gosh. I don't have a... Oh, is this count as a room for them? Because I don't have a room for them. This is, does this count as a slot? I hope so, otherwise I don't know what's gonna happen. I hope that counts as their slot. Wait for the stork, okay, it must. Okay, okay, so we have one couple having a baby. We have one couple disgusted with each other and unemployed. <laughs> we have a farmer, wait. Oh, you're single, that's why that's coming up. Okay, we need to pair up Drago, I mean, Dagobert. <laughs> Dagobert with someone. Dagobert, we need to find you love. Find your soulmate. It doesn't matter, just surroundings. No one here, please. It, I guess it has so much replay value. I feel like every experience would be different. Okay. Dislikes flowers and reading. Well, this one's not gonna work. Another one, please. Um, Likes fishing. Well, that's good. A little red flag here. You're as sweet as a... What? You're as sweet as a crunchy frog to me, Romeo? Okay, Romeo. Funny trait? I'm not even looking at half of the information on here. Let's uh, have Romeo move into Lakeburg. Romeo not liking poetry, right? <gasps> I forgot to look at the- No! Okay. Likes. Fishing. Public executions. 
And something else. I forgot the other thing. He calls people crunchy frogs. <laughs> I guess I'll have to wing it on one of these. Um, no, not... <laughs> Dislikes muscles, right? How about attending the next public execution together? Everyone close your eyes. This is the one I have to go with. I have no choice, Chad. I have no choice. It was horrendous. Absolutely horrendous. I should have no- It was a mistake to move Romeo in. It was a mistake. What a delightful idea. Romeo loves to boo. Okay. Great. You're gonna be a great addition to the community. Let's continue this charming rendezvous with a nice bottle. Um... Wait, they... They like fishing, right? Yeah, they like fishing. So this one. Good. They like that. Romeo giving Karen vibes. Every town needs a villain. That's true, Samantha. That's true. Okay, last one. Poetry is a waste of time. You don't like poetry. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. It's a match! At least they have a mutual love of facial hair. True. True. I do. Congratulations! Storks in the chat. Storks in the chat. Dagobert looks disappointed. They all look somewhat- actually, Odolin's the only character on this roster that doesn't look disappointed. And Romeo. Okay, Romeo's unemployed, that's fine. Actually- oh my gosh, what's happening? Romeo and Dagobert have met and developed the following feeling. Embarrassed. You guys are married, what do you mean you're embarrassed? What do you mean you're embarrassed? I don't understand why they have these interactions. I don't get it. Like they're supposed to... Okay, time is ticking by, Sarah. We need wood. Um, do they, they have a house, right? They all have houses? Oh, another sticky brew. Laugh again, laugh. Good. I don't know why that happened again. Okay, I need this. We need another worker here. Who's Who wants to become employed? Who would be good at? We need athletics and strength. Can I see your stats? Wait, what? Hold on, where do I see their stats? <gasps> oh my gosh, there's a child. Hold on. There's too much happening. Life? <laughs> there's too much information. Occupation. Morale. Jobs. There's a baby chat. We need some storks in the chat for the Juliana, the new baby. I'm just trying to figure out who would be good at chopping wood. Originality, personality, education, biological traits, life traits, life, expect life expectancy. Oh my gosh. This gauge is reduced every month. Morale impacts a villager's production time. Okay. Physical and mental capacities, okay. Citizenship level, okay. That's fine. Um, luxury needs. Essential needs, okay. 
Yeah, the baby needs to get to work. <laughs> New baby just dropped. <laughs> we have an unemployment crisis. Okay, we need someone who's strong. Who's... Okay, you're unemployed, you're unemployed. I just feel like one of them should become employed so they're not both like... I don't know. They could both just stay home together, that's fine too. Okay, so I need someone who's strong and... This one? These two. Six and seven. Okay. I think... Yeah, I think Mary is the best candidate for the Lumberjacks Lodge. When two or more workers are toiling to get- TOILING?! I don't like that word. <laughs> yeah, and we have a villain. We have a villain. Yep. Yeah. Stop crying and get to work, baby. Right? You can hear the panic in Sarah's voice. I know- I know to I, toiling to me sounds like evil somehow. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why it sounds like it's not a good thing. We gotta maintain a good ambiance. Problematic workers are marked with a bomb. Interesting. If they're trivial, they're marked with suspension points. Okay, right. As for nice workers, they're marked with a flower. Okay. So you have, what mark do you guys have? You only produce four? You got nothing on Victoria. You just need more practice, maybe? You know what? Four more. Every... However long is good. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna have more wood. What's happening here? Dagobert and Romeo have met? Why do you keep meeting? You guys are together. They're exhausted with each other. Topaz, hello, hello. The baby's working on fertilizer for the crops. What is the baby even? What is zero years old? Unemp it literally says unemployed. <laughs> Not an unemployed baby. It's just a little baby. Why are we saying they're unemployed? Ugh, wait, what? <laughs> no, it's not calling the baby ugly. Rowdy? Rowdy, weak, robust, and ugly. <laughs> I can't with this game. I can't. Oh, the time's passing, of course it is. I gotta remember to pause it. It literally says ugly. It's not ugly. Okay, so now we have three unemployed people. We have more space on the farm. I don't even know what I need. I guess they need food, right? <laughs> they need food. Can I build anything else? A sewing workshop. Interesting. Oh, I can build another. Wait. Lumberjack's Lodge. A hunter's cabin. What do I need? I need so much wood. Can I build a secondary Lumberjack Lodge? I don't understand. I need- Oh, this will help us get food, though. Clothes. Builder tickets. I feel like we need the hunter's cabin next. What's happening? Are they dueling? Victoria and Mary have met, and they share the following relationship. Insignificant. Okay. Well, good. That's fine. That's just fine by me. Oh my gosh, you guys, we're almost at 100 likes. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for all the likes on the stream, my friends. Not the ugly trait. I know, I can't believe they have that. That's so rude. Okay, so we have more wood now. Do I have enough to... Okay, nobody's homeless. Nobody's homeless, and... Everybody has a partner. And so now we just need 60 pieces of wood for the hunter cabin. We have 51, so we'll we'll get there soon. Do we have a recruitment of- Oh, we can have another neighbor move in? Oh my gosh, okay. We have Ellswith or Percival. 
We need jobs, right? We need jobs, but I have to use the wood to unlock the slots for more people to work. And I also need the wood for like so many other things. I need more wood. Uh, kick Null, take care, enjoy your shopping. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, Samantha says, I need to see how the makers of the game wanted this played because I see nothing but chaos. I keep forgetting to pause this. Hold on, let me pause the time. It is chaos. I think once you like get accustomed with the UI as well, that would be really helpful because for me, it's just very overwhelming, but there's so much to do. <laughs> Wait, what does this mean? <laughs> do we do we even want this new villager? Jax says, I can't tell if this is going well or if this is a train wreck. Same. Sisko says, go with the flow. The doctor letting them know the baby is healthy, telling them the measurements and adding, it's also ugly. Seriously, right? That's what it feels like. Lady of the evening? Lady of the evening gives 75 in athletics. Mace Mason. Huntress. Oh, I need a huntress. I need a huntress because I'm going to make a hunter's lodge. Man of the evening. Mason and seamster. I need the huntress. 28 coins. This could be a bad idea. This could be a really bad idea, but I need a hunter or a huntress. Okay. I think I made a mistake. <laughs> I might have made a mistake, but it's okay. Uh, Ellsworth is here. Ellsworth has joined Lakeburg. Um, one homeless villager. That's fine right now. I need a hunter's cabin first. I need that first. Build. Oh yeah, I couldn't imagine playing this on Switch. Yeah, I I don't know how they would do any like controller compatibility for a game like this, Cherry. It's fine for PC. Okay, so we have a hunter's cabin. So I need you to work here because you are a huntress. Perfect. Logic. The logic is sound. Okay, what's going on here? You're still unemployed, as are you. What kind of job would be good for you? Acquaintance with Izor. I don't know what you're good at. What are you good at? Okay. Play. We do need to build a house. Uh, I just need some more wood, as always. Oops. <laughs> uh, garden gnome, hello, hello. Nice to see you. Things are lurking. I'm just laughing at Samantha. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you have the chat replay on if you're you're watching the replay, my friends. Chat is more than half the fun. Okay, do I have I, I only have four pieces of wood. Okay, we need to speed this up. One single villager looking for love. Yeah, let's uh let's pair Elswith up with someone. Find your soulmate. Surroundings. Uh, Nicole, hello, hello, welcome in. We didn't be able to see this on a small screen. That's true. It does feel very PC. Like, it's a, very much a PC game. Okay. Oh, and don't forget, a reminder, if you're just joining in, I am giving away a copy of this game. So when the stream is done and it goes up as like a video, just leave a comment uh, on the video with your favorite stream memory or moment and you'll be entered to win. It's a Steam key. Uh, thank you again to Ishtar Games for providing me with the keys. Appreciate it so much. Okay, likes the art of war, not a match. Aww. Oh, this looks like a good match. They both like meditation and they both dislike the art of war. Okay, I'm not gonna make the same mistake again this time. I'm gonna take my notes. So 
Would that be pronounced Jan? Or would you actually pronounce the H? Jahan? We like meditation, fishing, reading. We don't like fashion, gossip, or war. Okay. Jahan? How can you dislike kittens? It's a crime. It is a crime. Okay, so we're gonna go with these two because they have matching stats or whatever likes and dislikes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so. No, we don't like war, so we're gonna go. This is good. They don't like gossip. Gossips are a plague on any civilized society. Oh. Good. Make fun of people more interested in their outfits than their skills. Okay, well, they don't like fashion. The dancing partner. We don't know anything about dancing, so we're gonna have to make fun of people that are more interested in their outfits than in their skills. Oh. That worked. <laughs> and finally, seal the deal. Uh, the benefits of meditation. Yes. Because they love meditation. To focus on the present moment. We did it! We did it! I need some storks in the chat. It's a match. It's a match. They're getting married already. <laughs> I think it's so funny how quickly they get married. Uh, pronounced like Jean. Oh yeah, it could be. That could be. It's a very unique spelling. Congratulations! We have another couple. And they are homeless. So, we're gonna have to build them a house. We just need more wood. Is there a quicker way to get wood? I feel like this is very like... I need more production value here, please. We'll become a peasant in 542 days. <gasps> uh oh. Uh oh. This is gonna. This is not good. Can I fire one of them? They both have the bomb icons. How do I replace them? Can I replace them? Okay. Produces eight. Get out of here. Better. Much better. Okay. <laughs> Upgrades on the right here. Oh. I didn't even there's so much going on I didn't even see. I do have money. I could do this. I could upgrade the basic production. Or upgrade the working conditions. Ah. Oh. I wonder which would be smarter. This could be like the long game. But I need more production. Oh, but I should do the conditions. Upgrade the I'm gonna be we're gonna upgrade the working conditions, okay? You're no longer to meet the inhabitants' needs for this resource. You need to find a solution. Oh no. Mary and Izor have met and feel dejected. Everyone's complaining here. Nobody's happy. You're still unemployed. Are you happy unemployed though? Like, how are you feeling? Not a baby? I just saw another baby. Oh my gosh, they have, they're having a baby. The Valver family's having a baby. They had a baby. An unemployed baby. <laughs> another unemployed baby. Dislikes kittens? Dueling and fashion? Ah! Okay. Oh my gosh. Uh, Ayana, hello, hello. <laughs> we need more storks in the chat. I can barely keep up. I can barely keep up with this. Okay. Romeo is bored. He has already finished his long list of tasks for the day and is wondering how to keep himself busy. Inactivity happens to be extremely distressing. He needs to find something useful to do if he doesn't want to go insane. Okay, how about you... How about you help in the fields? 
Grabbing some tools, Romeo decided to go help nearby farmers. He mowed, cleared, weeded, dug, leveled, and even chopped down a few trees in the heat of the moment. It was dark when he realized there weren't enough hours left in the day to get bored. Amazing. Good job, Romeo. Okay. Let's uh, build a house for the... Oh my gosh. For the homeless villagers. You guys can move in here. Perfect. Okay, okay. They're, they're not homeless anymore, chat. Still have a few unemployed. Oh my gosh, they're both unemployed? They have a child. Hold on. Hold on. I need to employ someone. Um. 100 wood for another slot. If invest in efficiency. Okay, okay. Do we have enough food? This is chaos. <laughs> we need a teacher. Literally, I need a teacher. I could do this. I could add another worker. I feel like we're gonna run out of food. Who wants to work here? Needs to be one of these two. They can't both be unemployed with a child. Two? Wait. Two? Two? Okay, they're all making two. Okay. You can work there. A ghost? Mary and Victoria met and felt scared? Wait, why? Why are you scared? Okay, well, we got more hearts. Unemployed. Interest. More neighbors? Oh my gosh. Okay, we have wood. What are we building next? Build. Um, a mason's workshop to produce stone. 90 wood. Okay. Not very close to that. Another neighbor wants to move in? Bridget? Or Jodafree? Oh my gosh. I missed. Okay, never mind. We have Eve or S Sig Sigismund? Sigismund? <laughs> uh, Mason. Man of the evening. Lady of the evening. I feel like I need a. Do I need a mason? Athletics? Do I need a mason or a baker? Food? I don't know what I need. They're getting more expensive. <laughs> you need to make sure the new huntress couple does not have a baby? Oh my gosh, you're so right. Let me recruit S Sigismund. Because I can't decide. I feel like I might need a mason. Okay, wait, yeah, let, no babies. These ones, right? Wait, but, okay. There's two couples right now. No, wait. Jean and Victoria have met and now share the following relationship. Secret crush? Snake? No. Stop it. Stop it! They had a baby! Ugh, I was too late! Okay, wait. You guys can't have a baby. Hold on. I, I, there's, I don't have the resources. I'm panicking. I'm freezing. I'm freezing up. I don't have the resources. You're obsessed with the idea of having a kid. I'm so sorry, but I... Just not right now, okay? Just not right now. Oh! I lost 25 love? No, I feel bad. I'm putting it back. I know I lost it all for nothing, but I feel too bad. I feel guilty. Um, we have a homeless villager. Wait, who has the- wait, who had the secret crush? Victoria has a secret crush on... Jean? Jean, you just had a- a baby. You're homeless. You need a home. Hi, Kofis! 
Not Octavia. I know, right? Is it because Odolin is unemployed? Like, why? What did I... Should I get Odolin a job? What did I do wrong? Homeless. Okay, hold on. You need a house. Build. Okay. Good. Sig... 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 You live there. Okay. A single villager looking for love. I can't. Um... Do we have enough food, chat? Are we getting enough food? Victoria and Mary have met and feel bothered. Okay, that's fine. You can feel bothered. Food, food. Upgrade? Add a resource. Yes, upgrade. That. We need that. Wheat. We need wheat. Every community needs wheat. That's good. Okay. 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 No need to panic. Everyone's fine. Everyone has their... Well, are they? I don't know if they're fine or not. I think they're fine. Uh, couples? Okay, you want some love? Here, let's find a soulmate. Surroundings. Kayla, hello, hello. Yes, you did walk into some drama. <laughs> Dyson says the stork not having to worry about job security in this village, right? Okay, so you... No, not a match. Nothing in common. A lot in common. They both like reading. They both dislike divination and painting. That's a lot in common. So that's good. I just look. I'm literally just looking for whatever. Whichever couple has the most in common. So reading. Muscles. And meditation. And then. Dislikes. Public executions. That's a, that's a green flag. Uh, divination. And painting. Okay, we're ready. This is good. Cisco says I'm never having kids. <laughs> uh, okay. Yes. They have stuff in common. Um, painting. Dislikes painting. Dislikes painting. So, kittens? Okay. Um, we don't like... I don't think they said anything about dueling. Okay, but we like meditating, so that's a bad option. So we might have to try this one. Okay. Last one. Uh, divination? Dislikes. So don't do that one. Muscles are the true pinnacle of human evolution. Yeah, uh, Gregory likes muscles. So that works. Okay. We did it. We did it. Another match. I feel like I shouldn't have done that. I feel like there's too many couples now. But I do. Congratulations. Okay. They're both unemployed. That's fine, right? I'm on year seven. Wait, how many years is this? Let's, should we fast forward this and see what happens? I can't have any more neighbors. There's too many people. I don't have any resources to upgrade. Okay, everyone has a house. Everyone has a partner. Everyone does not have a job. Let's move ahead a bit. Oh my gosh, look at my- Oh, I could have done that to get more wood. I could have like sped up the time. <gasps> no, 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 stop. What happened? What happened? Something popped up. Something popped up. Um, can I build something? How do I still not have 90 wood? Oh my gosh. I need 90 wood. Let's go. Let's go through the whole year. Forest fire? So I lost 30 wood because there was a forest fire? Wait, stop. It's going too fast. Stop. I'm panicking. <laughs> I am panicking. Okay, I guess I just lost wood. I still don't have enough. I need enough to... 
Izor and Odolin are friends? Okay, that's good. I just need wood to build the next building. What did that say? I don't have enough resources. Acquaintances? Good job. Am I supposed to do this? Am I supposed to just like fast forward to see what happens? Wait. The royal family doesn't have enough room to accommodate a child? Odolin? Wait. Odolin and Dagobert have met and now share the following relationship. Crush? <gasps> this is not good. I need 90 wood. Why? I just need 90 wood. No! No, you're both married. Stop it. I'm just trying to get this mason's workshop. Oh my gosh. Not even a secret crush. Yeah. Exactly. Ugh, who's gonna work here? Who was the mason? It was you, right? No. I don't remember who the mason was. You. Work. A child is old enough to be mentored? Okay, well, we're not gonna do it in the masonry. Where do we mentor a child? The lumberjack's lodge? The farm? The hunter's cabin? I mean, I need more wood. Oh no, they're both bombs too? Life expectancy? Down? Oh no. Uh. No, I'm panicking. You wanna work here? No. We need you. Why is the ambiance bad? You wanna work here? Okay, how about we trade you and then we mentor Julian. Oh my gosh, Julian has grown up. You mentor the student. And then you'll both make up for the other person who can't work there anymore because they're not. I don't know. Okay, flowers, look, they're great. They're, wor they're working well together. They're doing great. That's good. <sighs> Two types of resources. I don't have any money. I have 15 coins? Where did my money go? Okay. So... This candle is brewing hotter than any tea. So... Let's just fast forward a bit and see what- Not another baby! No, 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 no. No, who had a baby? They had a baby. Rose, wait. So cute. Dislikes me- <laughs> A newborn baby dislikes meditation divination and dueling good to know good to know energetic okay I need resources while having a romantic walk Mary and Izora noticed a cat sheltering beneath a porch with a litter of newborn kittens his reaction to those little cuties would be crucial. So adorable. Wait, what? Although Mary seemed to find the kittens very cute, he didn't seem as thrilled as Izor, who approached them while whispering calm words to avoid scaring them off. Mary wondered how many more animals Izor would adopt. Well, get- you know what? Insign- Uh... Chad? I'm panicking. <laughs> Princess Sarah sounds so stressed. I think if I like... I think if I was just playing this... Like... By myself... And I could take a lot of time to read everything, maybe... I would be less overwhelmed. 
Because I'm also... Oh, no! No! Not another forest fire. It's like the only resource I always... Am I never have enough of. I lost another 30 wood. How do I prevent forest fires from happening? I just feel like... I feel like this... I feel like... I don't know what I feel like. I think this is a really fun game that I think I need more time to- Ah! I need more time to actually pay attention to. <laughs> oh my gosh, if this was co-op and you could all do it together, that'd be so fun. Um, management sims, more like management chaos. It is absolute chaos. And... Yeah, I know you don't have enough room for children. I made that. That's on purpose. I think, how many years is this supposed to be? Oh, they're friends. That's cute. The kids are friends. I'm just gonna see how this plays out. I'm not gonna interfere. <gasps> Excuse me? Excuse me? What did I just see? I think I... Oh no, this is going terribly. Ellsworth's laugh offended Jean. How dare she mock her for her clumsiness. Oh my gosh, you guys. Gregory and Juliana have met and now share the following relationship. Why? Wasn't that a... That's... Wait, why? Stop. Okay, I think... <gasps> I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> Not Dagobert. Dagobert, I'm sorry. I just wanted to see how things would play out. <laughs> they say lightning doesn't strike twice in the same place, but in Sunstone Village, fire can. I don't know what's happening. Okay, it's probably because I have the, the... Look at how fast the time is going by. I was just curious, like, what would happen, you know? Because we were going... Like, if we're supposed to play through... <gasps> Stop it! I'm done. I'm done. Everybody's passing away. I just wanted... I wanted to see what the snake was over here. There was another snake. Two single villagers, you know what? I wish you all the best with your adventures in Lakeburg. Uh, so adorable. So much love. I, I don't remember what I was trying to say. I was trying to say, oh yeah, cause I'm... That's it. I'm really done. Odalyn was my favorite character. We're done. We're done. Odalyn was my favorite character. Stop the time. We're done. <laughs> I'm done. Odalyn, I... Odalyn was my favorite character. We're done. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna take a break. Um, and then when I get back, we are going to hop into Disney Dreamlight Valley. Yeah, we need some, I don't know what we need in the chat. That's the perfect emote. That's the perfect emote. <laughs> uh, don't forget you guys, if you wanna be a part of all the chaos, I am giving away a key for this game. Um, so once this stream goes up as a video, you just have to leave a comment on the video with your favorite stream moment or memory and you'll be entered to win a steam key so yeah you can be a part of this delightful chaos um this game has so much to offer so my first impressions i love the art style um i love the chaos i am overwhelmed playing it for the first time with the ui and i think like trying to play it in one of my shorter time slots for three cozy games is a bit tough because there's so much to unpack in this game and to like learn um, I think if you really take your time with it and like learn how to actually play it, um, it would have so much replayability like value in it, you know? Um, so, so far, I like what I see. It's a bit much for me right now because, well, you saw it. I don't need to explain that. But yeah, um, I'd like to try it again when I can actually really focus more on everything and like learn how to play it better. Uh, and yeah, don't forget to enter if you guys want to win. I'm going to take my break, uh, boot up Disney Dreamlight Valley so we can check out the update that dropped yesterday, the Dream Snaps update. 
Um, I'm also gonna get some more water. You guys get a snack, get a drink, stretch your legs, do whatever you need to do, and I'll be back in about five minutes, and then we will play Disney Dreamlight Valley.
Welcome back, everyone. <laughs> We're here with Disney Dream Live Valley. I've decompressed. <laughs> we get some moonstones in the chat to kick off this segment of the stream. That's our special emote for this game today. Uh, welcome in. Welcome back. Uh, hello to Kayla. Nice to see you. At least I ended with, what was it, 360 wood? That's good. <laughs> That's good. Disney Magic, yes. So they put out an update for this game yesterday, I believe, uh, with Vanellope and the Dream Snaps feature, which I'm really excited about. Um, oh, I also saw they added this, which I thought was really nice. Um, they added like a little kind of like content warning um, for the Forgotten Memories quest because it does deal with some pretty like strong emotions. Um, I played that through in two parts on member streams. Uh, very well, well done, very well written, but that's nice. They added a little heads up for people. I think that's nice uh, and important. Okay, I have my water. We're staying hydrated. I have my tea. I learned today, I learned today that there is such thing as too much tea. And I don't mean the kind that you drink. <laughs> I can't with that lot. That honestly, if we had like three hours for that game, I would love to see where it went. Oh yeah, and I have my little onesie. Do you like my onesie? Avery, hello, hello. Uh, I want the onesie in real life too. So excited for this one. Yeah, so um, I've been playing, I guess, a lot of this off of like regular streams. So I'm excited to be checking it out today. Oh yeah, I was checking out all the amusement themed items too that I got. So don't mind, this is not my design. This is just me like putting items out to check them out. Um, okay. So what we have going on, I don't even know what we have going on. We have a new character, but I have no idea how we'll unlock her. We'll have to figure that out. And then I have so many quests actually, guys, I have to do. I'm still working on the Pixar path. I need to hang out with Scar, so maybe I'll find Scar. Um, but I've got a lot of the rewards so far that I wanted, so that's good. Um, but I still, I still like to get as many moonstones as I can back, so I like to try and complete everything if I can. We all experienced it. <laughs> uh, debating on buying this game, but haven't made a solid decision. I think if you, this has a ton of content. This has a ton of content in it. So if you want a game to keep you busy, um, especially because, you know, there's been so many updates since it first launched. There is a lot to do in this game. Okay, I'm looking for Scar over here. Yeah, there's a lot to do in this game. I really enjoy playing this game. Um, especially in the beginning with all the quests and everything. It was so fun. Okay, Scar. Maybe Scar is at his place. I just want to hang out with him so I can get my points. I also need to eat something. My running speed is a little slow. Paleo showed off a fox onesie too. Yeah, that's so true. The uh, Chapa, I think. Was it the Chapa yes, onesie? I can really dig my claws into a place Hi, like Scar. this. Do you want to hang out? Ah. Live to please. Okay, my buddy for the day. Let's go hang out. Who here loves Scar? I love Scar. Scar's a great character. Look, we match, too. We're both the same, like, color palette. Okay, so let's check out the premium shop because I think there's new stuff there. Oh my gosh, I have to get used to the... I switched back and forth from PC to uh, Switch, so I have to get used to the controllers. Oh, this! I want this so bad. Look at this house. This is something I might actually spend my moonstones on because uh, I've been wanting a beach house. Uh, starry days. Hello, hello. Welcome in. I 
need to talk to someone to start the update. Okay, that's good to know. I'll let you know if I need to figure it out. Oh, this is cute too. Island inspired ensemble. I want this. I feel like Merlin deserves this outfit too. <laughs> I feel like Merlin deserves this outfit. Bermuda Merlin. Are you kidding me? Is it a fox or a red panda? Oh yeah, it could be a red panda actually because some of the rewards are... What does it say? It is a red panda onesie. Yeah, because this there's like the red panda pillars and stuff. You guys, I think I'm going to get this. This is the first house that I'm like, yeah, I definitely want that one. I think I'm going to get this one. Um, And so in the update too, they've added a new way to get weekly moonstones. So I feel even more like comfortable. I've been like hoarding mine, <laughs> but... I feel like I can spend some of them because it's going to be easier to get them if you participate in like the dream snap stuff. So I'm going to get the beach house. Oh, I'm so excited. This is my first uh, house that I've, I've gotten. Like there's been a ton of different really pretty ones, but this is the first time I'm actually getting one of them. I feel like Merlin deserves this outfit. I'm going to get Merlin the Bermuda fit. It's just too good. Scar is your fave, Cisco. Anastasia says I love Scar. Scar is one of your faves too, Avery. He has some fun songs in the Broadway version. I have not seen the Broadway version. Um, okay. So we got those. Let me equip Merlin's fit. Oh, I'm so excited. This is gonna be perfect. Oh my gosh, I love it. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, that is Merlin from Sword in the Stone. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. And then we can go place my new house. That's the first time I've spent moonstones in the premium shop ever. We could get some moonstones in the chat for that milestone. I... Oh my gosh. I for... Spoilers. Is she really just walking around? She's really just walking around. Like, no big deal. Oh my gosh. I can't believe Sarah Moonstone is here. That was Sarah Moonstone. I don't know if you saw her. She's just over there. She's just hanging out. Sarah Sunstone and Sarah Moonstone both in the same... The same place. Can I talk to her? Hi! Oh my gosh. I'm feeling pretty good today. It's weird. Embrace happiness whenever you find it. I guess that's true. I shouldn't waste this feeling. Maybe I'll write some happy poems today. Sounds great, Sarah Moonstone. Have a great day. Don't forget to smile. Don't let Mother Goffle get to you. <laughs> what? I know, isn't it spooky? Hi, Stitch. Oh my gosh, look at Merlin. Well, hello. Greetings, my friend. Uh, s mm, something you want to ask? Sure, we can talk. Oh, I think I'm actually supposed to <laughs> talk to Merlin for one of my star path things. Extraordinary. A trip to Goofy's stall. Who knows what one will discover in his inventory today? Epic apple versus pear Rather dilemma. Peculiar. <laughs> I love the fin. Lots to do, lots I to love do. the fin. Okay. So, also, how do these dream snaps work? I didn't see, like, a new... Did I see a new UI or anything? Or do they not have one? They have to have one on launch. On launch of the update, right? They couldn't not have a dream snap thing. Oh my gosh, do you see that? The icon for that? That's cool. Uh, let's go to the beach, I guess, and place my house, and then we'll figure out what on earth we're doing after that. I do want to check uh, Scrooge's shop, because I still- I don't have like a ton of furniture items. So I definitely would like to collect some more. See what he has today. Oh, where do I put my house though? I might have to move this one. 
That seems like a good place for it. Or... Uh, I don't know about there. Ariel says you got, you got your yellow hat today? Oh my gosh, that's so exciting! That is so exciting. I'm so glad. I hope you love it. I hope you love it. I think I'm gonna put my house here, maybe, next to this pool. Move these trees. Oh my gosh, it's so much easier to decorate on PC than Switch. I haven't done much of that yet. Ugh, I wish there were six of these. Okay. Um, how do I- I don't even know how to put- Oh, house. Beach house. Oh wait, it's huge. I might need to move some more stuff. Hold on. Um. Wait, this is so cool. Look at this house. This is so cool. It has a tire swing too on the side. Oh my gosh. I love it. Oh, this is all one piece. I didn't even notice that. Yours just shipped, Daniela. Oh my gosh. Thank you guys so much. Uh, Simon says I need to order some stickers. So many stickers. Thank you, Simon. Um, okay, so then my little backyard pool can go here. Just need to move. Oh my gosh, we could do like design streams, you guys, now that I have it on PC. Because I was definitely like holding back from doing much with design. Because I, I didn't really have the patience, to be honest, um, to decorate on Switch. It's not like the worst. I just didn't have the patience for it. This is looking so cute. Hmm. I'll just do something simple for now. I can add more details later. Um, I do also have this. Perfect. I think I can add just more trees, right? This is so fun. Um, Cherry says, would I need to buy the game again if I want to get it on PC? At this time, yes. Um, but in the future, because this game is eventually going to be free to play. So originally I was waiting uh, for it to come out free to download it on PC. And then I could go back and forth between Switch and PC. But because it's been like... You know, I just, I kept waiting and waiting and then I was like, you know what, I'm just going to buy it because I, f I felt like it would be better for streams specifically to have the PC version. Um, so I just went ahead and went for it. But if you can wait, then you can, you can just wait until it comes out for uh, like free to play and then you can just download it for multiple platforms. It's totally your choice. Cause yeah, I, I just didn't have the patience for like the, um, like how finicky specifically the placement was with the joysticks. But again, I know they're probably working on that too. So, oh, this is a big thing. Wait, this would look good here actually. Hold on. I just want like lots of trees. Okay, okay, okay. That's good to start, I think. I don't know if I have any other, like, items to use right now. I mean, I probably do. I have so many, though, it's like... 
to sort through them. Like this would be cute. Miss this game? A lot of people will play it when it's free. Totally. Totally. Um, I miss this game too. I used to play it like a lot, a lot. And I definitely don't play it as much anymore as I used to. But I'm, I'm happy we've been playing it like semi-frequently. Definitely has a special place in my heart. I'm just seeing if there's any other like obvious items I would like to put out right now. Just saw Threading Pixels announced a new collection. Takumi, yes, the stray one, right? The stray one? I love stray. I want to play the game again, actually. I was kind of disappointed that the big announcement for stray was not a new game. <laughs> it was, uh, that is coming to Xbox, which is cool if you're an Xbox player, but I was hoping for like stray 2 or something. A leaf pile rug. I didn't even know I had that. That's cool. See, I have so many items and I just don't know like how to sort through them the best or like what to do with them. Oh, I have another one of these. A blue hammock. That's cool. I need to like familiarize myself with my own collection of items. Oh, Disney! Takumi, sorry, I thought you were talking about the stray collection. I didn't know there was a Disney one. Well, that's cool. That's very cool. Look at my house! Look at it! That was so worth it. That's so cute. Need to decorate more, Vovi. Uh, Cherry says I use the arrow pads to tap things into place. Yeah, yeah. I was doing that too, because otherwise, like, good luck. <laughs> and yeah, they haven't given a date for when it's going to be free. They originally said, like, early this year. Um, and then that changed. I it's kind of weird to me, because it almost seems like... They're kind of acting like, like they haven't mentioned it. You know what I mean? They've just, they've not like addressed it in a while. Uh, they're just moving ahead with like all their updates for early access. Look at my pool. I definitely need a chair here or something so I can sit. Let me grab this chest. Okay. Is there a squirrel following me? Oh, pro probably. Who's equipped today? Um, oh yeah, it's my squirrel companion. <laughs> uh, the gray one. I have all these companions. Oh my gosh, we could match. Let's all, like, be on color theme today. All three of us, look at us. We're a little trio. Okay. So I'm very happy with this house. Um, if you don't know how these houses work, is it literally gives you like another home. <laughs> so, uh, interestingly, the storage is connected to your other house. I'm totally gonna make this a beach house interior. So now I can like go home here and access my storage as well as, you know, my main house. That's really nice. Um, I need to eat something. Oh, let's see what we get here. Ooh, Mickey Mouse mirror. Nice. I'm gonna eat this. Then I can run around a bit faster too. Oh yeah, I have to keep these separate. I don't want to... These are my quest items. Okay, okay, so that was the premium shop. Now I need to basically find Vanellope. Ah, uh, yeah, Ariel lives right here. This is Ariel's house. And here's Ariel. Hi. So excited for multiplayer. Yeah, multiplayer will be fun for this too. Um, I don't know exactly how they're going to implement it. It seems like it's going to be like valley visits. So you can visit other people's valleys. I think that's how they're going to do it. Um, but yeah, I don't know when that's coming either. I, they put out a roadmap for like their updates for the year. 
but that wasn't mentioned, I don't think. Okay, so... Hmm... I am going to go to Scrooge's shop next because I want to see what items Scrooge has. What's my favorite thing to do on land? Uh, dance. <sighs> we dance underwater too, but it must be so much harder when you have to stay connected to the floor. There are so many interesting things to do on land. Uh, they're both amazing in their own ways. I guess you're right. There are lots of fantastic things about both of them. I wonder if Ariel knows the Coral Island merfolk. <laughs> I wonder if they know each other. Oh yeah, and I made these little pet things. These are some of my pets here. They just hang out. They're little items. Oh, there goes Buzz Lightyear. <gasps> the portal's still there, chat. Why is the portal still there? I thought it would go away. I guess not. Is it rude to assume? I don't know. I don't know. I was just hoping she would know them. Maybe we could get a, some insider info. Uh, anything I want. What is this? A washing machine? A dryer? Sure, why not? Could come in handy. Thank you kindly. What is this? A mirror? Stop it. We've been over this before. Stop it. Any clothes I want? Not really. <laughs> hey, Eric. Eric is always being Eric. Monster's Ink Couch? I don't have that one. I think, yeah, I have that rock. Oh, this is so cute. Hanging chair, I want it, I want it, I want it. That is so cute. Thank you, kindly. Thank you, Scrooge. I mean... <laughs> Thank you. Bye -bye now. Eric, stop it. <sighs> Ugh, chat. Very nice. Thanks for the performance. You have a quest for me? Good day, dear. Sarah, thank goodness you're here. I need your help with a potentially supernatural matter. Oh, is it Stitch again? I was exploring the dream castle looking for hidden rooms and treasure troves when, bless me bagpipes, I think I saw a ghost. It was probably me. <laughs> it was probably me. It's probably Sarah Moonstone. Uh, the dream castle is haunted? Aye, it's possible. My ancestral home, Castle McDuck, had ghosts and apparitions clear to the rafters. <laughs> but this specter looked different than any ghost I've seen before. It flickered in and out of sight. Since you're an adventurer like me, I want your second opinion. Could you go to the dream castle and look for the ghost? I last saw it at the very top of the stairs next to the fountain. Goodbye now. Goodbye. I could. Um, sure. I thought it was going to be to do with... Uh, Stitch. Because Stitch is always being a bit of a pain. Uh, story days, take care. Thank you for hanging out. Um. Oh my gosh, I'm blind. There we go. Track this one. What else do I have going on, though? This is the alien toys. Oh, I found all of them, so we can bring those to Buzz, too. I need dream shards for Minnie. I still need to make chocolate chip cookies. Oh my gosh, I have so much to do. Okay, let's start one thing at a time. Let's uh start with Scrooge. Let's go to the castle. 
I should do this one. Is he bragging about his old house being haunted? I think so. Is Eric married to Ariel? Did they break up? Do they have their daughter yet? <laughs> I don't know what, what the timeline is for them, actually. Um, okay, so we're looking for a ghost. No big deal. Is it by the fountain? I think that's at the top. Oh, is it this thing? No, that's- a <gasps> Oh! Oh, it's Vanellope! Oh, okay, okay. Um, I have not seen... Hello! Oh my goodness. Is that what their voice is like? <laughs> I haven't seen the movie. Uh, finally, somebody's here. Wait, wait. I've been rehearsing for this moment. Greetings. I'm Vanellope Von Schweetz, princess and president of Sugar Rush and slaughter race driver extraordinaire. So, who are you? And what's this freakishly sparkling place? She's from Wreck-It Ralph? I think so. I haven't seen that movie. I wasn't expecting that to be the first audio line. Me neither. It is what she sounds like. <laughs> That's her voice in the movie. I haven't seen the movie. I don't even know what it's about. Uh, I'm Sarah and this is Dreamlight Valley. So you're not a ghost? Yeah. Not unless I died of boredom from glitching everywhere. Uh -huh. Normally I have complete control over my glitch, but one day, pow, I glitched onto this freaking network I've never seen before. Now I'm stuck. I have no control and I don't know why. Magic and technology don't always mix. Maybe the dreamlight magic here is messing with your glitch. Ugh, why am I not surprised that a place called Dreamlight Alley is lousy with magic? It's a good movie. I might have to watch it then. There's gotta be some way I can help you. Well, do you have one of those doohickeys where you talk into it and it takes pictures? Because I have an idea. A phone? What? <laughs> yeah, do you mean a phone? Yeah, that's it. I'm seeing a lot of photos being shared on the network I'm stuck in. If you try taking a picture and sharing it on the network, maybe we can see what it's all about. But hey, leave the castle and take a picture of something awesome, will ya? Show me what I'm missing. Come on, you can't say no to this face. Look how adorable I am. See ya! See ya! Okay. Let's track that one. I said let's track that one, please. Some optional quest content can only be accessed by using our Dream Snaps feature. Dream Snaps is a fun new game mode that lets you express your creativity and earn exclusive prizes. Decorate, take a photo with your phone, and submit. It's a snap. Okay, so the Dream Snaps is actually connected with Vanellope because I was looking for it. But that makes sense. So yeah, this is what I was excited about, you guys. It's like, I think they're weekly challenges uh, that you do. Like, I don't know if it's all going to be design. I think it might not be. But you basically take photos and then... Oh, it'll tell us more. Okay. Uh, under event, challenge requirements can be found in the Dream Snap section of the events menu. You can also check challenge requirements in photo mode with D or in your wardrobe or furniture menus when Dream Snaps mode is activated. Okay, I will try to remember that. D. Okay. So... Can I not open that now? Event, dream snaps, current challenge. Oh, look at the reward. It's a red chest. So this one says, cross the finish line by decorating in tribute to everyone's favorite racing princess, Vanellope Von Schweetz. To begin, check the challenge requirements. Uh, decorate an area in your valley with furniture that uses the required challenge tags, so playful and familiar. Also suggested modern and Wreck-It Ralph. Snap a photo with your photo and submit it to... With your phone. <laughs> Snap a photo with your camera and submit it to Dream Snaps. Okay. And so, from my understanding, like, everyone will get yeah, some sort of reward from doing this it's not like just the winners quote unquote it's actually like it just if you participate you can get moonstones every week uh which i was excited about because just more ways to get moonstones without actually buying them is uh good news in my opinion so 
let's track this one. Oh, this is literally to participate in the Dream Snaps challenge. Okay, let's do it then. Let's do it. That's what this update is all about. So, I don't know where I'm gonna make this little area. Uh, Terry, hello, hello. I've watched the clip where Vanellope meets all the Disney princesses. Is that in the movie? That's the only part of the second movie I've watched. Oh, there's more, there's more than one? The second movie's not good. I didn't even know there was more than one. Okay, I need to find a space for... Maybe we could do it by Minnie's house. Because it's like colorful. Or by the balloons. Let's do it by the balloons. Like right here. So I need... Uh, let me check the requirements again, because I already forget <laughs> uh, what it wanted me to use. Playful and familiar. Okay. Playful and familiar. Um, can I sort them by that? wreck it Ralph. Playful. Familiar. Modern. I love that we can just pick all the filters and then- Oh no, I didn't want to reset it. Modern. Playful. Familiar. And Wreck-It Ralph. So I just go back and it keeps that? Oh, I have three items. Oh, maybe for all of these tags I have three items together? Oh, look at this. We can make a little- we can make a little food stand. Can I put the computer up here? Nope. Okay, that's fine. Um, what if I take off certain filters? Like, if I take off Wreck-It Ralph. Oh yeah, then we have lots to work with. You liked the second one? You liked both movies? I just didn't know there was a second one. A pinata? Vanellope's gonna love this. Balloons? Um, is it weird to put a couch outside? <laughs> a rusted trash can? I don't know about that. Um, okay, what if I take away the modern tag? Oh. What if we just do... Playful? What if we just do playful? Anything with color I'm trying to add. I feel like she likes a lot of color. I'm not- I don't have space here. Okay. I didn't even know there was car racing in the mo in that movie. I mean, I have no idea what it's about, so. That's not saying much, to be honest. Lounge pillows? Oh, we definitely need this. Yeah, for sure. I have more than one? Are they the same? The different colors? No, they're the same. I didn't know I had two. I love that item. My Halloween stuff. Holiday stuff. This could work too, actually. Oh, can I not center it? Nope. Why would I be able to center it? I can center it with a balloon. Does this help? It... Uh... Did it help? 
Did it help? Is this all the playful stuff? Oh my gosh, it moves so fast. Put the little camera here. Sisko says, I'm glad we'll be able to center things in Palea. Totally. Oh, it looks like a dream, the way you can move things around in that game. Like, honestly. Because it, it, it provides you with a grid, but you can do completely gridless decoration, it looks like. Um, this customization, though, in this game is pretty good. Like, there's a pretty good amount of precision. Uh, with the placement much more than like m most games i'd say that's one thing i'm really hoping we'll see um with coral island is for it to be less like restricted by the grid eventually it's on my wish list so yeah did that help i'm not even sure what it that did it said to press, was it D or something? Hmm, not sure. What is familiar? Is that what it was? Oh, for familiar? Okay. Oh, because I need a certain number of, I need like a certain number of some of the items, right? It's not just like use them. It's like I need a certain, like five or something. Yes. Okay. Uh, Bovi, thank you for lurking. Is familiar like, I don't know what familiar is, to be honest. I do not know. Wanted to try to put two of these here. I have to move some stuff. I love that you can just move trees in this game. <laughs> if you don't like where a tree is, just move it. Okay. Um, let me back out of here and see what I where I'm at for the requirements. Five playful and five familiar. I was not counting. <laughs> Uh, Gloria says, I have the game but haven't played for so long. Stopped. Oh, honestly, the Scar update was probably the least interesting. But there's been so much added since then because I got bored then too at that time. Um, but they've added a lot since then. That's like really fun. More main story and stuff. Quite a bit of main story actually. Like two updates with main story since then. Um, I don't know how many of each item I used. Oh no. Will it show the things I've already used? I don't get it. Why don't I get it, you guys? I don't get, like, because it's not showing me which filter is on. I feel like I have to do it myself. Playful. Wait, hold on. Did I not have a plant on here? I swear I put a plant there. Okay. 
Wish I got Stitch. You can still get Stitch. You can still get Stitch. Stitch is super cute. Oh, these are cute. So one, two, I'm just gonna count from now. Two. Three, meal in a cup. Bag of tricks. Oh, that's a big bag of tricks. Uh, four. Five. Can I not put this here? There we go. And then five familiar. I'm running out of space though. I'm sure some of the stuff I have already meets the requirements, but I, yeah, did not. Yeah, this one. I thought I had this one out here. One. Two. We're going for clutter core. <laughs> Is Lakeberg Legacies the closest Sarah will ever get to rage quitting? Maybe. Maybe. Also the challenge last stream. The the coffer one? Oh, this Pixar ball. How big is this one? Oh, it's quite big. Mmm. I was, okay, I was more overwhelmed playing Lakeburg Legacies than I was playing Only Up. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. I'm not even exaggerating. That's so funny. I need three more items. Oh, these, I wonder if the other balloons counted though. Little teapot. I wish I could put something on this. I wish it would save my place too, actually. Oh, it does show the stuff. Is this the No, this is inside stuff. Okay, three. Four. This is the busiest, most cluttered. Oh, a birdhouse. That doesn't go at all, actually. <laughs> Counter seat. I can't tell if I've met the requirements or not. I think I have. I think I have. Piano bench. It's just a little cluttered, but I've kind of met the requirements. Uh, Cherry, take care. Thank you for hanging out. See you again soon. Can I sit on this? Lounge. Okay, Scar, I'm gonna need you to get out of the photo, please. And Sarah, I'm gonna need you to get off your phone. I need to take a picture. Oh my gosh, you're not gonna be able to see any of my... Hold on. Let me move out. You can't see all the items. How are they gonna know that I met the requirements? Oh, maybe like this? I still feel like you don't see all of the items. I'm gonna have to move out even more. Let's go like here.
Scar? Excuse me, buddy. Would you mind moving? Image format? <gasps> oh, thank you. I don't need to be so far then, but I do need Scar to move. You can tell I don't take many pictures in this game. <laughs> Hi, Merlin. Merlin, would you mind, buddy? There's always someone. There's always someone. <laughs> Photobombing. Like, always. Like, what is Merlin doing? Okay, let me pose. Oh. <laughs> Why? Why am I do- Maui? Oh, this is good. Let me pose with my animal. Merlin, could you please move? I'm trying to enter a photo contest. Merlin wants to be in, in the- if he would move over, like, right here, then I would allow it. Merlin's playing Where's Waldo? Merlin, do you want to just come over a little bit? Oh, whatever. Good enough. Okay, show dream snaps. Do you want to submit- Oh, look, I got 15 out of 5. <laughs> I used so many. <laughs> <laughs> sure, let's submit it. Why not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good enough. Your picture was correctly submitted and you received 50 pixel dust. What is pixel dust? For future challenges, we will send rewards to your mailbox. Wait, what is this pixel? Oh, now you move? Okay. Sure. Of course. Of course. And you're here, oh my gosh, this is just every time I stop for like one second, I'm surrounded by everyone. I'm overwhelmed. So, we're gonna go to this because I, no, we're gonna go to this because I did that. Okay. Uh, we don't need to hang out with Scar anymore. So, you can go. Uh, let's hang out later. Finally. This grew tiresome long ago. Okay. Ta-ta. Now we're gonna go talk to Vanellope! Who's the purple thing? That's Sarah Moonstone. What's Sarah Moonstone? So Merlin made it into my submission by photobombing. I can't believe he moved like right after. Like he knew. I wouldn't have minded having him in the photo. I just wanted him to move over a bit so you could really see him. He likes the Where's Waldo vibes, I guess. Okay, Vanellope, I'm back. I took a photo of an area I set up for you. You better like it. <laughs> Hello. You're back. To be honest, I was 50-50 on the chances. I came back as quick as I could. Aw, you're a real pal. Thanks. When you added that photo to the network, I saw these pixelated dust bits all around me. Yeah, I want to know what that is. Oh, Canadian accent. Sorry, Miss Moonstone. You don't need to be sorry. Oh, the sorry. I'm like, why is... How do you say O oh, in a Canadian accent? Of course, it's the sorry. <laughs> Look, I've never... I didn't know there was a Canadian O. Uh, when I touched one of them, I was solid again, just for a second. And I know where I go when I'm not here. I've been glitching into other Dreamlight Valleys. Oh my gosh. <laughs> the dance move. The dance move. There are tons of Dreamlight Valleys and Dreamers, and they're all connected. That's the network I'm bouncing around in. Oh yes, we know that. That's the coolest thing I've ever heard. 
<laughs> Ultra cool with whipped cream and chocolate sprinkles on top. Now that I've been all over, I know your valley is the one I want to hang out in. Vanellope, I bet you say that to everyone. I'd put a lot of money on that, actually. I'd put a lot of moonstones on that. You say that to everyone. I just need something to log on to. What did Tammy call that thing in Hero's Duty? Oh yeah, a beacon. Make me a beacon and I can get out of the network. You know, something that really calls to me. Something that feels like home. Okay, let's make a beacon. I have no idea what Vanellope is talking about. Oh, place Vanellope's house in the village? Oh, it's gonna be that cute candy house, right? Uh, salad, hello, hello. I don't know where to put the candy house. I really don't. I'm not sure. Because I don't have, like... I have space, but which biome? Like, I feel like... It could look cool in, like, the frozen area. Or I could replace the carousel with Vanellope's house over here. But then where do I put the carousel? Decisions, decisions. This is so cluttered. I wonder if I should just put it over here. But then where do I move? Hmm. I think I'm gonna put the carousel over here. I think that's what I'm gonna do. That makes sense to me. Peter Pan? Is that even? Can't tell. My mo I have to go get that. I have to go get the moonstone chest. Wow, I can't believe this is so much- <laughs> This is so much better for decorating, oh my gosh. I really haven't done much uh, since I got the PC version. It's a game changer. I do think it's nice that they have the option um, to play it on Switch, though, for early access. I think that's nice. And it's it's pretty good. Like, I spent way more hours playing on Switch than I have on PC. So, it's very good. Just not as much for decorating. Uh, I'm just going to remove these ones. I don't think I want them. Okay. Looks good. So now we can move this over here. And then I can move Vanellope's house here and like readjust all this stuff because I don't need it there. What was the mission title? Oh, Faith, Trust, and Pixel Dust. Of course, because of the pixie dust. I haven't seen any Disney movies in a really long time. I think the last one I watched was... Tangled? I want to say, when you guys recommended it to me. Pretty sure that was the last one I, I watched. I'm just gonna clean up this- no, no, I want to pick it up. Clean up this area a little bit. I 
could spend like hours just picking everything up in this game. It's like really satisfying just to like forage and uh, clear stuff up. Okay, so the house will be here. No, it won't. Wait, what? Place Vanellope's house in the village. Oh, I'm blind. <laughs> there we go. I just had so many markers. I didn't even see hers there. Okay. So I'll put the house there. It's going to be so cute. How much is this going to cost me? Oh, greetings, neighbor. Ah. Uh, how much? How much? Four. Oh, I thought it was 40,000 for a second. 4,000 is not that bad. 4,000 is not that bad. I thought it said 40,000 at first. Okay, let's see. Oh, my clutter is obstructing the view. <laughs> That's so funny. Welcome, Vanellope. Very nice, very nice. We're moving in. Nice. I guess I can take a picture. Why not? Welcome in. You wanna go see your house? Oh my gosh, look at her hair! It has like little stars in it. I'm here. Thank you, Sarah. Thank you. Her dance is so funny. <laughs> uh, Kicknell, take care. Thank you for hanging out. See you again soon. Uh, my glitch is back under control and I'm ready to explore. See you around. Very cool. Okay. So, that wasn't too bad. That was pretty easy. Wow, look at this house. This is so cute. It's like filled with candies. Check out the inside. Oh wow, this is so cute. Look at the donut chairs. Is this kind of what Wreck-It Ralph is like? The aesthetic? Look at the candy corn, that's cute. Super cute. Little arcade machines. Wow, this is quite the place. This is quite the place to live in. I can't believe a small kid lives in that place. Reminds me of a teen's room in the 2000s. I could see that. Not Simba Hakuna matata -ing. Where's Simba? He was over here, right? I gotta take all this down eventually, because that's not gonna... I could actually keep some of this up for her yard, but I definitely have to fix it. Definitely have to fix it. Dream home? Is that anyone's dream home? What is your guys' like favorite... If you can pick a favorite house in this game. I'm trying to think even what mine would be. Because there's so many like different ones. I really like Merlin's castle. I think it looks really cool. I'm trying to even think of, there's so many. But yeah, I really like Merlin's castle here. This one's nice. Um... Scars rock. Oh, the pumpkin house, of course. I love the pumpkin house. 
I love the pumpkin house. This one. <gasps> There's two moonstone chests. I forgot about the pumpkin house. You like Buzz's trailer? I was so confused about Buzz's trailer. Like, I didn't understand why Buzz had a trailer. <laughs> I didn't get it. I missed it. Oh, let me sit here. Excuse me. I'm gonna sit right here. Yeah, I love this house. This one's so nice. The furniture, yeah. It's very nice. Okay, there was that other moonstone chest I have to go get. Uh, when I was decorating, it was just in here. The boat. Yeah, the boat is really nice too. I love that they get, you can place like houses in the water. I feel like that's such a nice touch. And gives more space because it's really easy to run out of space for the houses. Uh, in this game. Even though there's like a, a huge map and a ton of space, it's just like... To place them where you, like, want them to be, you know? Is a different story. We have to serve some customers, too, at the restaurant. Yeah, I like Merlin's place, too. I think that's probably one of my favorites. A lot of people, I think, don't like Wally's house. I actually, like, don't mind it. I think it fits perfectly here in the, in the forest. Like, obviously, it's not, like, pretty, but it suits Wally. So I just put it in the forest. I think it's not bad. My least favorite house would be Remy's house. <laughs> this one right here. <laughs> Cause it's just ridiculous. Okay, we need to make apple sorbet, Kronk's spinach puffs, and spicy baked bream. I'll definitely need some of this. You... You like uh, Wally's place? Remy's is a little over the top. It is. I mean, I like it. I do like it just as like a building, but it's just a bit much for a rat, you know? <laughs> Woody's so tiny. Uh, Buzz is so tiny. I like mistake them for like critters all the time. Um, Amy, thank you so much for the sub. Welcome in. I guess that's true. Remy is a celebrity chef. That is true. That is true. You got me there. Make some apple sorbet. Remy really said fine dining and living. Yep. I wonder if, like, he cleans the place himself. Or does he have, like, help? Because it's so big. Hey! Moana, here's your apple sorbet. Kronk's spinach puffs. Oh, thanks. Oh, nice. I need to do these, too. The, the dreamlight tasks. Spinach puffs. I don't know if I've made those before. Kronk's spinach. Is it Kronk from... Emperor's New Groove? I don't know if I'm... I can't remember. I think it is. Uh, Kronk, Kronk. I think these are... These are alphabetical, but then they're also by category. So it's kind of confusing sometimes. Here we go. So I need cheese for that one. Okay, let me check the spicy bream too. Uh, spicy, spicy, spicy. Oh my gosh, so many recipes. Spicy. I'm looking for spice. Spicy, this one. Butter, okay. Got it. It is. In the Latin dub, Kronk makes empanadas, really? Oh, that's so awesome. 
I love empanadas. They're so good. Wouldn't be surprised to see Remy's family live. <gasps> Does Remy have a family? That would make sense. I never really thought about that. Okay, now let's do the endless scrolling here. I already forget what I... Here we go. Spinach puffs. Emperor's New Groove. It's such a good movie, isn't it? I haven't seen it in so long. I still to this day wish Disney made a roller coaster based on... I don't even remember how to say that character's name. The Lair. Where they pull the lever and the coaster would drop you and go. That would be so cool. I remember that part of the movie was like so fun to me. Watching as a kid. I haven't seen that in so long. Now I really want to watch it actually. I remember it being so funny. I remember it being such a funny movie. They should have a ride based off of that. They definitely should. Hope we see Kronk in the cast someday. I played, when I was a kid, I played a, an Emperor's New Groove game. It was like a PC game, I think. I'm just unlocking a memory right now. It was like partial like platforming, I think. Oh my gosh, I'm just remembering. Hi. I'm starting to have these like visuals. It was super fun, I remember. I don't know what it was called, but I, I did play it. It was a PC game. It was back when like every movie was being made into a game. <laughs> At some point. Hey, thanks. So glad you're here. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Got both of those done. Adios. That's all I can do for now. A Lion King and Beauty and the Beast PC game. I feel like I had a lot of those random, like, I didn't have a lot of them for the PC with, like, earlier days, but then later on, I feel like I had a lot of, like, GameCube games based off of movies and, like, DS games and stuff. I feel like I did. I was a sucker for those because I really liked, um, you know, all the different movies. We need some tourmaline. Oh, yeah, and we can go to Buzz because I got all the aliens. Just have to figure out where he is. He's over here. Of all the things they need to remake as live action, I'm wishing for Emperor's New Groove, Atlantis, and Treasure Planet. I still haven't seen Treasure Planet. A lot of you guys have told me to check that one out. I still have not seen it. Oh my gosh, why do they move? How does Buzz move so fast? He's so little. He's so little, and he's, like, on the other side of the... Get back here. Stop it. There. We got the 25 alien toys. Darcy, hello, hello. hello. Nice work, Space Ranger. You rescued a lot of aliens, however, I can't shake the feeling there might still be more out there. I'll keep doing reconnaissance and let you know. In the meantime, I want to reward you for a job well done. While I was scouting for the aliens, I put together a little something for you. Let's call it a Space Ranger Supply Kit. Just a few resources I thought you might find useful. Thank you, Buzz. What's in this kit? Okay. I get two? Or just one? I guess that was a glitch. Open, what's in my kit? Oh, thanks, Buzz. Wow. That was so nice of you. <laughs> All that for... <laughs> okay. That was not the best reward. I already have so many of those things. <laughs> I thought I'd get something interesting. For all my hard work. Collecting all the aliens. That's okay. I appreciate the, the thought. It's the thought that counts, right? It's the thought that counts. Yeah, you can sell items for sure. I try to keep most of like the crafting materials, but... Yeah, you can sell stuff. 
You can't sell though like furniture, I don't think. Unless they've changed that. You have to like, if you buy like two, I don't know if they've changed that or not, but in the beginning, if you bought like two of one thing, you like just keep them. You don't sell them back. Um, give Buzz his favorite gifts. Talk to, oh yeah, I have to talk to Elsa too. Where's Elsa? Elsa. Right here, right in front of me. Literally right in front of me. Hello, my uh, FJ, hello, hello. I am Canadian, yes. <laughs> I am Canadian. When I said about... Not when I said sorry. What is... About. How do you... I don't even know how you're supposed to say it. I need pure <laughs> ice. Every time... There's that game called Wholesome... Out... And About. And every time I'm so self-conscious when I try and say the name. Because I just know it's... <laughs> yeah, yeah. I need this special ice. Okay, now I have to watch Treasure Planet too. Simon, thank you for lurking. The about is very distinct. So interesting. I don't even... I don't even know what it is. I don't know what it is. Okay. So was that... Was that it for the update, I guess? I thought there was going to be... I don't know why I thought there was going to be more. I know it's just a mini update. Oh, okay. So hold on. I did this. Congratulations on completing the Dream Snaps tutorial. I guess I'll opt in because I want the rewards. Wait, so was... I guess that was just a tutorial that wasn't actually... Okay, so I actually have to dress to impress. And create regal designs as you throw your very own dreamlight ball. Ends in five days. Okay. Well, that's cool. So there's another one already. I'll probably come back to it. I don't think I have. You guys? Lakeburg Legacies fully wiped me out. <laughs> I, like, I'm not even kidding. Like, I don't have the the energy to do another like design right now because of I'm like the chaos was just rampant <laughs> um so this is the official dream snap so the one I did was just like a practice it was just a practice okay that makes sense that makes sense I think I am going to wrap up the stream here, you guys, because I think we've seen, like, everything this update has to offer. I'm really happy with my my house. It's super cute. That's probably, honestly, my favorite thing about the update is the house. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Um, just a reminder, um, Lakeburg Legacies, I will be giving a code away for that. So once the stream ends, just make sure you leave a comment uh, on the video with your favorite stream moment or memory and you'll be entered to win <laughs> so you can also partake in the chaos i honestly you guys i think it would be so fine if you're just like hanging out by yourself and taking your time with it but it's just a little overwhelming like on stream and stuff um and i was not prepared for all the chaos like mentally i knew there'd be some but there's a lot more than i thought there would be um, but i'm glad we checked out the update uh, had a lot of fun with all the chaos of Lakeburg Legacies and Wildflowers was super chill too. So I definitely want to hop back into that one at some point. Uh, if you missed the first two games, definitely think about going back in the replay to, to check them out because there's definitely something there for you guys to, <laughs> to enjoy. Um, I think that's all I have to say. I have a um, 
I have a member stream on Sunday. We're going to be playing Pikmin, the new Pikmin game. Um, also, I will be reviewing applications for new mods. So if you want to apply, I'll be onboarding some new mods hopefully soon. Um, if you already put in an application, I've seen it. So don't worry, I've seen it there. Um, the, the whole thing is still open. So I'll just go through them all again and uh, reach out to you if you like basically meet the requirements. Uh, other than that, thank you so much to, uh, who do I have here? Thank you so much to uh, Cisco, Tansy, and Danny for modding on uh, the last little bit. Appreciate you guys. Appreciate all my mods for helping out today. And I think that is, I think that is everything, my friends. Um, I'll have a new video on Palea out soon as well. So keep your eyes out for that. And you know, if you're on the Discord, make sure you have your notifications on, then you won't miss anything. Same for YouTube. Uh, all the love, my friends. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Thank you for the member chats. Appreciated seeing those today and welcome into the new members. Thank you so much for the gifted memberships as well. Uh, thank you for taking care of each other. Be sure to also take care of yourselves. All the love in the world. I'll see you very soon. Bye, everyone.